right, all right, all right. Seems that everything's working. Just making sure here. Hi, everyone. Hi, Cultus. How you're having a fantastic Sunday. Okay. Let's get, let's get into the game real quick. Okay, awesome. Hi, guys. Hello. We are here once again in Dark Souls 1 with the amazing Rocky Balboa. Uh, wow, man. <laughs> I am still shocked about the amount of progress that we did yesterday in regards of how many bosses and areas we cleared. And if you were here yesterday and you see a change in our appearance, it's because I did something off stream. I decided to make sure that the armor that we're using is the best that we can because we're going to go down the most difficult areas of the base game now. And also, I went on into the Painted World and farmed the, the souvenirs of reprisal needed to get the Dark Moon Blade. So, with that done, we have absolutely... I think we have either double or triple the damage that we can do now with this... Look at that. Wham! We have now a Magic Fist that will crap on every single thing that we mess around with. So, um, we are really close to finishing up the game. We just have two more areas to go. The first one is the Duke's Archives. I think we can run on that area real quickly. And then we need to go into the Tomb of the Giants and defeat Nito. After that, I guess we are going to go to the DLC and see how we fare there. I'm... I am not sure if we are going to be able to, like, completely get the game done today. But I don't know, man. We're so close, I can, I can almost taste it, right? So let's let's go on and let's warp into... I guess the, the, the closest one will be, like, Anvil Londo proper. Let's see. Because we need to go into the Duke's archives. And hopefully the magic on there is not gonna be too difficult for us to deal with. We are... we have... let me see your, show the equipment real quick. I also went and bought, bought a couple of charcoal pine resin just in case. I also got lightning resin. We have the flippy ring, the ring of favor protection. The... also went and got the Gondor of Thorns, and we... that's also bumping their damage. We should be like 10% more or something like that. And... The armor, I know that we don't look fashionable, right? Like, we do like a doofus. Look at this. We look bad, man. But that's the best armor that we can have that allow us to still use the flipper ring. So, that's why I'm having this. And... Normally, I'm all about Fashion souls, and if you don't know the term of, of fashion souls, then I am sad for you because you should. Pretty much is a rule in this game that, oh, again, dude, please don't put your ass on my camera. Uh, <laughs> it's an unspoken rule on Dark Souls that you don't wear armor to have better protection. You wear armor to look cool, right? That's that's the whole point of any RPG. Is not to be powerful, but to look cool as hell. Or at least that's that's the goal for me in any RPG. <laughs> Especially like games like Final Fantasy XIV, um, MMO that I enjoy quite a lot, if I not if I'm honest. Okay, we are doing kind of good damage. Ooh. Wait, this this guy always had like the, the donkey kick? What? I didn't know that. That was... We are learning, guys. Even even right now, as we are approaching the end of the game, we are learning. So, uh, the best thing, the, 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 the show of power in any, R, in any respectable RPG is actually looking cool as hell. Or at least that's my opinion, right? So, I, uh, I know that this doesn't look like cool or nice for... A boxer build, but hey, this is the most amount of armor that I can get while still being able to fast roll. And if I'm honest, I am a little bit scared 
w with this area because there are now a bunch of mages. Oof, this this took forever, man. That's that was annoying. Ooh. Oh, he dropped me the look at this. He dropped me the uh, the fangbore helm. So now we can. Oh fuck, we are, we killed we killed another animal. Oh my god, we're gonna get in trouble. Look at this. We can wear him as a helmet. And now this looks cool, but it weighs like a ton, and I don't want to deal with that. So, again, getting back to our basic things. We're gonna really, really try to survive this area. And let's see here real quick, because I know for sure uh, there is another piggy right there. God damn it. Okay. Hey, piggy. Fuck you, piggy. Oh, damn it. Let me light this bonfire. Oh, he won't let me because he's right here, right? So we actually need to kill this asshole. Okay, so I think that's this will be a good way to show the power of Dark Moon Blade. Okay. So we were doing like what? 45 damage? Look at this. Well. <laughs> I was actually hoping for a little bit more defense, but or a little bit more damage, but that's fine. Oh, damn it. Donkey kick. I, it is so slow to come out. But I, as I was, I, I thought I was going to be able to get another head out before he kicked me. Okay, but it is, it is slowly getting to him. So let's, let's just kill this. I think he doesn't respawn after we kill that, so that's fine. So we can rest now. Ooh. Wait, did he get me another? Hey, we got two. We got two of the helmets. That's great. All right. So let's go up here. And oof, I don't know. I, I didn't have like today. I I know I messed up. I I've been kind of busy in the morning and the, the, during the day, so I I didn't prepare any topics. And I really wanted to have something to prepare for you guys because I want to. Somewhat give the impression that I'm good at what I'm doing. <laughs> so yeah. Oh, but that's good damage, man. Like two, three hits and they're done. That's cool. Wham. Wham. Okay, two hits side by side and should be enough. But this is the problem with this era. There are archers and mages and they're going to try to come from all different areas to try to kick our asses. So yeah. So... I know what I can I talk about. We can talk about my morning routine because everyone wants to know about my morning routine, right? Right, guys? Oh. Ooh, chilled. Thank you. Okay, stupid archer. Fuck off. Ooh. Is that thing about to hit? Yep. Oh, shit. Tactical retreat. Now, it's funny now that we ha that when we retreat because we, ha we do this stupid handstand thing. So we're like, trying to avoid everything. <laughs> it's funny. It's, uh, for me, it's, it's stupidly funny. I don't know why. It's a merry and dumb. Oof, mother. And that's what I'm telling. That's what I, I was referring to in regards to having a way to actually survive this bullshit area. Because it is a little bit bullshit, I'm not gonna lie. Like, they do so much damage. Like, so, so, so much damage in this area. So, after I wake up late. Because I I played a little bit more games after we ended the stream yesterday. I said like, well, well, now that we have this, let's. Well, that's when I farm the the items. It was like a couple. It was like a, an hour. What the fuck, man? Did you saw that bullshit? I mean, it was a headshot, but god damn, man! Like that was. Absolutely ridiculous. That's all my health in one swing. Like, fuck off. Whew, okay. Uh, this has been harder than I, I believed. So I woke up late. I had lunch. I had breakfast with my wife. And we started watching One Piece. Oh, that's the item for the DLC. So we started watching One Piece, right? Ooh. Oh, because he buffed them. That's how they're kicking my ass with just one hit. Motherfuckers. Motherfucking... 
Trident, dude. God damn it. Thank you. Let me stay here for a moment. Uh, so yeah, we watch One Piece. The new arc, the Egghead arc... Hey. I'm not gonna say that it's bad. I just... I think that it's good. And it's thinking that it is so good that it's actually hurting my feelings. The fact that I have to wait for more revelations. Because they are, now they are... I don't know. I think they're now taking this thing seriously again. And we are really getting some... So import, so important drops of actual information, and the mystery is getting like I know that the the, the pirate anime with the stretchy dude didn't seem like the prime I don't know the prime thing that you were going to find like a mystery to solve, but hey, hey I mean oh fuck me there was another right there fuck 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 fuck, fuck. let's continue to heal. And I also got like 20, 20 blasts because I know that I was gonna get sloppy because I, I was trying to talk to you guys. So. <laughs> and I think we're doing we're doing fine, but now that they are buffed again, fucking hell. Okay, you should be dead now. Thank you. Where is this asshole? Oh, right there. Hi, asshole. Oh shit. Okay, cool. He's dead. Now that they are going to be dead. Oh, oh, oh shit. Oh crap. <laughs> this area really fucking hates me. <laughs> That's why I waited for having a bunch of chapters and then see it. Uh I don't know. I don't know if I can if I can do that. I did it with Wano because Wano was actually boring. But, uh, I don't know, the story is so good that I, I really need to see it. I really want to know what's going on. And I, I know that if I say that, I should re be reading the manga, but as again, I'm not really a manga reader, so I'm going to just be a patient little piggy and wait for for the anime. But I, it's, I don't know if you are, Kuro, if you're keeping keeping up with what's going on in One Piece. I, I, I guess you're you're waiting for... To have a couple more episodes in the arc, or maybe you already saw everything and you're just waiting. <laughs> I don't know. Let me know. Oh damn it. Okay. But yeah, pretty much that. We watch One Piece. I have uh, two episodes pending. One for solo leveling that I'm probably go going to watch later, later today, and another one is for the anime that I was, I was talking to you talking about you. Oh, sorry. My brain is melting. Is there another dude there? Yeah, I remember you. I remember you. Fuck off. Thank you. The anime that I was talking about yesterday with you guys, the... Um, about the elf girl that sees every, 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 every one of his friends die. I had it pending. Ooh. Okay, that move is kind of annoying, dude. The shuttle tackle is not... not nice. Let's see if I can... Okay, fuck you. And he's spamming the fucking move also. Like, stop. Fuck off. You see that? They're now spamming the fucking shoulder tackle. Insane. Fucking insane. They're waiting for all egghead. Uh, dude, do you know that that's gonna take like a... I, I, I'm guessing it's gonna take like a year. Or something like that. Because I am... I've been trying to not spoil myself about the, the story that's, that's coming, but of course I I am not making... I'm not doing a very good job about that. Because people people always send me like clips or like the shorts on YouTube are the worst thing that they ever created. Not because they are not fun or help your channel grow and all that, but because you can get spoiled so quickly. And that's why I also don't have a TikTok. Because first, cringe. Second, uh, everything gets spoiled on TikTok, and fuck that. But, of course, uh, you can avoid the internet forever, so at some point I have seen things that are going to be coming. And also, it doesn't that matter, I have a huge list of anime to watch. Hey, that's, that's true, that's true. If anyone else can wait a year for the, the Egghead arc to be completed, it's you, because you are going to be watching every single thing again. That comes out, so yeah, I understand that. 
there is a way to to skip this what's coming but i don't remember how to we're just going to tank it like a man okay so here we have the crystalline knight which i really like the design and when i thought about doing the challenge well not a challenge like a playthrough for youtube Ooh, damn okay thank you oh shit oh shit <laughs> Okay, let me heal up. Thank you, bro. Can I parry your stupid sword? Let's see. Yes, I can. Oh, you can parry me! Fuck! <laughs> God damn! Okay, okay, that was unexpected. No, fuck it, fuck that. One more hit. Okay, didn't know this asshole to actually parry me. Holy shit. That scared me. That actually scared me. Now, Kuril, let me ask you something. Um, what would you say that is the weirdest anime that you have ever watched? Because as I... As I said, like, I don't... I am not a very good or a very avid anime reader, so... I'm looking for recommendations, you know? And I know that I have been... I don't know, I, I haven't kept my word when I said that I was going to watch an anime because I tend to forget or I tend to uh, postpone it. Conception. Conception. Okay, that's something that I have never heard, so... Proceed with the explanation. <laughs> A harem. Okay, now that, that term I know, so yeah. Now, this will be the the bane of every single... Ooh, damn. Okay, thank you. Of every single Dark Souls run. If you want to take... If you want to make it without skipping any of them. Because that is... Um, that death is necessary and you cannot skip it. Unless you do some other tricks and, and things like that. So, that's a bullshit death of the series. And we are... Okay, we're good. And we have now trapped in the crystal library thingy. It's a harem. The guy has a relationship with a... With a raccoon. Uh, you, you're, you're... You're... Like the, the animal the raccoon. Like... <laughs> like the, the, the little panda thief. That raccoon. Are you serious? So is it like um okay I, I I know that I asked you for the weirdest thing but um I wasn't expecting that right I mean <laughs> I wasn't expecting someone to have a like the animal that talks what the fuck man oh shit okay let me heal let me heal let me heal let me heal I hate the fucking shoulder tackle I hate it so much okay fuck you and fuck you again for that matter Okay, that's weird, man. That is absolutely weird. And I, I, I knew that that would probably have... I should have probably thought about something like that. There wasn't anything for killing those dudes, so yeah. We wasted our time there. So, to escape, we need to punch this dude. GG. Get the key. And let's make our breakout. Escape. Now, man, man but it has a relationship with... A but you tell me that it's a harem? And it's a relationship like they, they like like get intimate with a raccoon because that's I don't know if I I I don't know man. <laughs> I really don't know if I want to know. That's that's my that's my worry, you know? I don't know if I want to know if they're actually having a real uh, like a relationship with a raccoon. I don't know. <laughs> oh, don't run away. Come on. Fuck you. And he's also running away. I am not gonna let ya no he left he, he left. Ah, damn it. Okay. I'll get him later. We're talking about two. Maybe another is a good one to watch. You know what the weirdest thing is? I know that at some point of my life I watched another. I know that I did. 
but I can't remember anything about the story. I know that it's like the uh, the the girl with the eye patch, and that the dude is kind of annoying, but I don't remember what happens in it. I for for the life of me, I can't. So maybe I don't know. I had. I don't know. Maybe my my brain melted, and that's why I cannot remember anything about that game, I, about that series. But damn. But I, I'm for sure know that I that I watched it. I know that it did. Because and it's gonna be silly, but I think that the reason that I watched it was because I um I was dating a girl and she was like, oh I love that, I wish we could watch it together and all that. And of course, well, I tried to watch it and I watched it, and I don't know if maybe I was too distracted and that's why I don't remember anything about the the actual series. <laughs> That's maybe uh, the, the reason. I am not gonna lie to you guys. <laughs> because as a teenager, I was really, really dumb. And I can for sure see that that's what it, what it, what it happened. And yes, they let you know, the main character have... Why? Like, why? <laughs> okay, now I definitely... I know the answer for my question. I didn't want it to know. <laughs> But what's the point of having, like, sex with a raccoon, man? What the fuck? I uh, don't know. Anime is so weird. Like, I, I love the meme, and uh, it's gonna sound absolutely horrible, so I'm going to apologize in advance. But I love the meme that says, like, never nuke a, uh, a, <laughs> a country twice. Because that, because you're gonna get Japan, pretty much, and... For what I love of Japanese culture, and they have a lot of things to to be proud of. They have like the weirdest minds of all time, and I don't think that that's debatable. I don't think so. <laughs> so again, apologies in advance. I know that that wasn't a really nice thing to say, but that's that's my opinion, man. And I love that mean. I love that mean. I like. Dark humor in general. I like it a lot. And also... Oh, okay, let me be careful because I don't want these monsters to actually kill me. I, they give me two spells that I won't be using. And here it is. Big head Logan again. Trapped. Now let's go turn off that awful music. The anime is an adaptation of dating sim game. Okay, for some reason that makes a lot of, a lot of sense. <laughs> that for some reason, you tell me that this is an adaptation of dating sim, and I believe you because I know dating sims are absolutely weird. And for some reason, it makes more sense. Now, now, now I under, now I can say like, okay, I understand, of course, totally, totally cool with this, with the raccoon thing, because. Correct. I I know that at some point I saw like um, what's it called, like a dating sim, and they were they were like pigeons or something like that. And there was another one that I saw like a uh, big YouTubers played at the time that you were dating like that. I don't know. I don't know why. I don't know how. Hi Nat. Welcome. You didn't miss most, much, I'm just sucking at the game and killing lizard people. So yeah, sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know, dating sims are weird. Again, and dating sims are, if I'm not mistaken, and correct me if I'm wrong, things that come from Japan. Oh well, not all of them of course, but most of them come from Japan, so... Again, another... another... Way to give me. Oh shit. <laughs> okay, this is getting stupid. Okay, this is getting absolutely ridiculous. So I'm going just to stop this. Take. Okay, and now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, thank you. Thank God, that missing is so annoying. Okay, 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 okay. What am I doing? So little damage to this, to this thing. Like holy. Fuck you. 
that's the thing that we, we really needed the bump on damage because we are really 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 bad is that good scary uh i wouldn't say scary we'll say weird it is weird i don't say that is oh fuck no oh shit <laughs> Okay, I'm running to the bonfire. Fuck this. We got the key to get out of here. So that's that's the important part. Oh, damn it. Uh, is, are they coming for me? Yep, they are. God damn. So, yeah, dating sims. They are between dating that, dating... Oh, I, I, I know something that... I, okay, Kurot, let me know if you if you played this, because I am curious. I, I, I will never touch that thing, but I am curious about it. Did you know the Dead by Daylight also has like a dating sim? Did you know that? And if you did, did you play that? <laughs> because it's the weirdest concept to me. Okay, let's heal up here. You don't blame me? Yeah, I know. I know that I asked. And I immediately regret it, so... <laughs> no one to blame but me, right? No worries. <laughs> uh, no one in the chat is going to judge you for... <laughs> for your anime watching, but I will judge you because why? Why do you would you be, be having sex with a raccoon? Oh, your mother! Oh no! Like step. Yep. Yeah, it's a dating sim. Yeah. And did you play it? I'm curious. I'm curious to know, like, how do you get the premise of Dead by Daylight? Like actual killers trying to murder you, and get it into a dating sim. Like, I don't know. And for those who don't know, like, Day by Day like this... Uh... I will... Uh, asymmetric, competitive... Um... Well, well, there will be, like, a scary... Not horror -y. Yeah, it's like a... Objective-based things, like... A MOBA, but with... Less toxicity, because there, there isn't chat involved over there. But yeah, so... No, but... Now that you're asking, oh no. Yeah, I'm curious too. Because it's, it sounds weird. Like, the premise itself sounds absolutely weird. I'm curious. As well. You know what? Let's do something. As I am curious, you're curious, and... We got nothing better to do. Let's see how the, price, the price on Steam, and... If it is like, if I got it on discount or whatever... I'm gonna play it. I'm gonna play it on, on, on stream just to see what the hell is going on there. Because I need to... S Ooh. Okay, forgot that that guy was over there. Okay, please come here. Don't use a stupid tackle, please. Do not tackle me. Okay, backstep. Awesome. Good. Okay, there's an arrow guy there. I am curious too. Okay. Can I roll through the arrow? Yes, I can. There's another dude there that I want to avoid. That guy, that guy, I remember. Oh, damn. You will go for the Huntress. So you like... You like your, your dummy mommy, right? And I, I am disgusted that I know that term, man. <laughs> You're like your big tall woman. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> and okay, that's uh that is a mage there and a chandelier here. Yeah. Fuck your dancing, dude. Fuck your dancing. Okay, so let's get I need I don't need to remember how do we progress here. Because I do not recall how to do this. Oh shit. Okay. We're we're getting we're getting places. We're no, I mean, she only sings. Oh, okay. Uh, ooh, okay, okay, okay. Okay, fuck me. Oh, still hit me. Bullshit. Okay. Are there any items? No. But I think there is a, something over here, perhaps? Nope, oh, just a stupid archer. Over there. Damn it. Okay, so let's kill this dude. Oh shit. Why are there so many archers? God damn it. Uh, 
Entonces, la, 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 la. <laughs> hey. Uh, that's what we need to find out. That's what it, actually we need to find out. Okay, no. Fucking archers, dude. Come on. Thank you. Is there something there? No. Okay, there is... There shouldn't be anything else important here. Okay, more archers. This place is like archer down. Fucking hell. Okay, fuck you. Thank you. Anything else that wants to mess with me? Besides the mage and the archer? Like, another archer maybe? Okay. Okay, archer. Fuck off. I don't know, it's weird. And I know that... I know that there is... Uh, like, they, they had in that game, like, the Huntress... And I want to say, however, I'm not sure, like, the spirit? And it's gonna be weird, because the spirit is the, the killer that I want to learn to play the most. Okay, he moved over there. God damn. Let's, let's spin this up. I hate your dancing. But I love that we can get the weapon if we can actually dance like them. Fuck off. Anything important around here? Not really. Okay, let's continue. I know that there is like the spirit. I know there is like the huntress because I've seen the, the images. And I I think there is like the trapper. So do you want did you want do you, from those three who would you date? The spirit, the trapper, or the huntress? Just just to know. Just because I, I am still curious. If if I had to choose Ugh damn. Uh Damn, I guess the Huntress, yeah. <laughs> I guess. Because <laughs> the spirit is... A trapper, he seems like a nice dude. Hey, uh, yeah. That is something that we have to actually acknowledge. Like, trapper in the game looks cool. And he's like playing like volleyball or something, so... <laughs> ah, but I, I will go for, for the Huntress. Crystal Ember. And, okay, and also this is like Mimic Town, because we beat one Mimic over there, and this is another Mimic. Oh, by the way, uh, I had a, a meeting with the last, the last d and player that I was missing for the character. We already, cre we have created the character together. And hopefully next Sunday, we're going to be playing, ooh, the symbol of Avarice. Look at this thing, this thing is so weird. Look at the... Uh, you should be here. Look at me. I'm bowling, man. Now, I look like a badass. Awesome. But <laughs> oh, that thing... That thing helps you increase the chance for drops on enemies. But it also drains your health, so... Eh, not really my, my type of deal. Just joking, I think I'm not being serious to Spirit. But the thing with the Spirit is that she's always angry, right? So... Would you like to, to have that on your life? <laughs> I don't think so. I don't think anyone wants to have like a like a perpetually mad like someone around, right? It should be. It's, I think it's it's gonna get old quickly. Let's repair up. Cool. And let's get the boss. Now we are going to get into these. Forest thingy, and we're gonna get into the crystal caves. But the Duke archives, for the most part, are done. We, just need, we I think we just got the key for the giant cell, so we could go and free login. I think we can. Yeah, is it this one? No, the the giant door. That should be the thing. But let's kill the boss first. And now being serious, the spirit, the spirit, the spirit. I don't know, man. The spirit is... I, it wouldn't be my pick. It's my pick for, for gameplay purposes, because I love the, the power. And I have been getting some amazing... Like, amazing kills with it. But I don't know, man. I, I wouldn't date the spirit. I mean, yeah, they're serial killers. I know that. I absolutely know that. But come on. Like, at least the other one sings, right? Before it kills you. The, the, the spirit is going to be like, ah, ah, 
I don't know. I don't want to die with that sound on my head. I don't want that thing that to be the last thing I hear, right? <laughs> at least I, I at least the, the the huntress will sing me a lullaby while she kills me. I'm probably I'm probably going to to run away and she's gonna snipe me with a hatchet like half across up the forest or something. <laughs> Oh man, okay, now this is a crystal caves. There are a lot of crystal golems that are um, frustrating to face. And this is the mechanic, if you can call it that, of this area. They are like hidden platforms. And you need to look at the... I'm gonna say that it's a snow, but I, I, I don't think it's snow. Uh, the crystalline thing is dropping to know where to go. And there are also a bunch of those motherfuckers. And like one, two, like like four of these things around. And I am not gonna mess with those things because fuck fighting the moonlight butterfly with a me with a melee build. We need to be careful here because I know this thing is really slippery. And we have that dude there trying to kick our asses. Okay, so please don't kick my ass. I said please! I said please don't kick my ass, and that's the first thing you do. Come on! Fuck me. If you can choose, I would like to be killed by a Xenomorph? Ah. Okay, so we can discuss that. Okay, let's, if you want to argue with, that, with me about that, let's, let's go. So, you will be... You will like to be killed by a Xenomorph. So, you will like to get... Okay, because I, I know it's gonna sound graphic, because it is. So first you're gonna get attacked by a Xenomorph, you're gonna get hung into a wall. They are going to place the the egg in front of you, like all the, all the ritual thing, right? Now, they are going to have... you're going to have to wait for the egg to, to open and have the, the hand thing, the... I'm forgetting the name and... I, I am a horror buff, so I should know it. The face hugger. Okay, thank God I, for, I remember it. And you're going to have the, the face hugger. Because you know that that thing actually, like, tries to fuck your face, right? Like, that thing, I think that, that, that thing fucks your face to get the, uh, the egg inside you. <laughs> so I don't know if I want that. I really don't know if I want that. <laughs> I mean, respect if you want that, but I don't know, man. <laughs> If I ever have to be killed, I want it to be like either in a spectacular fashion or something quick so I can not suffer that much, you know? But having my face like uh having that in my face, I don't like it. And after that, of course the the like like scientists say that there are there isn't like a pain comparable to to childbirth but hey i think that having okay i need to be careful here because i think i'm gonna fall and be okay thank you it should be right in front of me and i know that it had the are you gonna fall oh crap <laughs> okay let's let's run <laughs> because indeed he's coming he's coming oh shit and then the the, the 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 pain of having the chest burster came, come out of you, and I don't know I don't know what kind of creature would will will it like generate you know I don't know I don't think it's gonna be pretty that's the only especially food chain oh uh, hey that's a way to, of looking at it oh man they are not oh shit. I am thinking that when the, f the fight begins, I'm gonna have to deal with the boss and the army of clams. So I might have fucked up. Uh, I mean, I think I think I get it, and I, I don't get me wrong. It, the the xenomorph are a fantastic creature design. I don't know. I I just want to I don't know like get blown up or something. That would be like an Instant and fabulous way way to die. Now, question. Yeah, the clams are here. Fuck me.
Okay. Damn. And how many are there? Three clams. Fuck me. <laughs> how many? How much damage? Oof. Okay, they are... Yeah, they can kill me in three hits. And... There are three of them. Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, but they take damage. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. We might have... A way out of this situation. If I can get the boss to hit the clams... We should be golden. We should be fine. Or I can just kill them myself, right? Let's see, let's see. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's awesome. Okay, cool. We, we did it. We survived the clams. <laughs> so let's finish up the buff and let's go. Okay, I think you can survive. Thank you. Thank you. It's so cool that you have faith in me. Because I don't. <laughs> Okay, let's go, let's go. Now let's punch him in the dick. Wait, is that another clam? No fucking way! <laughs> oh, you motherfucking creatures, I hate you so much. <laughs> and I got so caught up on having a clam <laughs> behind me that I forgot to dodge the attack. God damn it. Alright, so... Damn. <laughs> Unexpected. I think that... And I don't want to do this because that's annoying. But I think we have to fight the clams before getting into the boss room. Which is gonna be... Uh, I, I really thought that we could just skip them. Okay, 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 okay. Let's go. Okay, let me see. Have a good, I have a good question. For what killer do you think you act? What do you think you can survive? Okay, how so? Like... Oh shit. Like... Okay, careful here. So... We're talking about the killers on Dead by Daylight? Or like any killer? <laughs> and which... Whom or from whom I could survive? I mean, in most situations, like, and that's the cliche of horror movies, right? Like, if you just keep running and just don't be stupid and start, like, oh, let's run two steps and go back and two steps and go back. Oh, I tripped. Oh, I'm dead. Like, if you just run it <laughs> and you don't allow the 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 killer to catch you. I think you can survive pretty much anything, like... Let's say, like, Freddy, well, like, Jason, like, Michael Myers, you can just... Run, right? Run, call the police, have them shoot him a bunch of times, and eventually it's going to either disappear or they're going to lock him up. And you're going to survive for a year, and next year they're going to... Get free, and you'll have to repeat the process. So, every... Myers teleports. Yes, but after getting shot. <laughs> so at least you have like a little bit of a breather and you have to wait until the second movie to to have him back. Like do you, for 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 Michael Myers you just need to to add, to surround you yourself with police officers on Halloween night and you are you are safe. Because after that he doesn't do anything. <laughs> like he's a complete like he gets um in an asylum until the next Halloween. But you just need to worry about one date of the year. For Jason... I mean, that dude... Like, went to space. And survived and killed a bunch of people. So... That would be a little bit more difficult. However... Like, Jason can be... It's funny, because Jason can be like... He cannot be killed. But he can be like, stunned. Like, you can kill him... And he's gonna be lying there for a while, and after, I don't know, some couple hours or something, he's gonna just, like, stand up and try to kill you again. So it's a matter to just put him down and, I don't know, get him, get him on, a, on a, like, concrete jail wall thingy, right? Like, just 
impossible to escape. And that's it. And don't have like a stupid teenagers. Oh no, I know, I know what's best. I, I, I have, uh, I had a revelation. I, if you want to escape every single killer or slasher of any movie, there is just one solution. And it's gonna be silly, and you're going to. I hope you enjoy this, this, the thing. But just don't have sex. If you don't have sex, the killers don't see you. And that's a fact. You can see any slasher. And you see that if you don't if you don't do that, they're 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 going to leave you alone. Like you are invisible to them. <laughs> and I mean teleporting No no, it's Michael Myers, the one that technically teleports, right? It's not that he has superpowers or anything. It's just like for dramatic effect, John Camperton likes to like cut to something else, got back to Myers, and oh wow, he he's like Batman. Stupidly enough, he's like Batman. Like he you see him there for a moment, and after a cut, fuck me. <laughs> fuck me. And after a cut, he gets he, out of the frame and he disappears. So now we have we have concluded that Michael Myers is like Batman. And that's my take on it. <laughs> oh man. All right, now we are suffering more fighting some clams at the actual boss of this area. <laughs> so I am thinking if I just run run past them again and have the boss kill them. Because I think it's better for just have the boss deal the damage and just circle around until the boss deals with the with the things. I think that will be for the best. Okay, let's let's run away. Let's run away. And now I didn't show you the worst part of the crystal caves because it is it really is important and nobody wants to see it. Remember the um, the invisible things with the snow. There is like a one path that is isn't like a, a straight line like the other two that we have been taken. It's like a maze of crystals that are invisible, and I believe there is like little snow or no snow at all. At all. So you really need to like predict the future and know where the path is, and it's absolutely annoying. And that's the way that you get the item for upgrading a magic weapon to the max. I think it's not worth it, man. It, it's really, it, it's really, isn't. it's right across there. Oh. And let's continue the killing of innocent animals, because why not? I forgot that those things were here, so let's let's make them appear again by quitting. And Nat, I'm sorry if you're, if you're watching this again. They are really cute things, but they have to die. I need that the upgrade for the weapons. So it's a necessary evil. <laughs> okay, now once more for the last one. And this is the thing that, that that's this is the thing why I don't want to go to the Great Hollow because we're going to have to do this a lot. No, you're not going. Oh, he'll. Okay, I don't care anymore. Let's get out of here. I just wanted to kill them for the fun of it, but nah, doesn't matter. Let's kill some clams. Anyways, and there that I was talking about the Great Hollow, it has like ten or fifteen of those of the crystal lizards. And they have a knack for disappearing, so... Is the other clam going to come here if I... I know there is something that makes them come. One is moving. Which one? Okay. Clam, come here. Thank you. Let's take them one at a time. And hopefully we can survive their stupid attacks. Okay, so fuck you, Clam. Okay, the other one is coming. So I need to kill this quickly. I'm sorry, what now? You can launch me to space. With that attack. Okay, I didn't know that. Thank you. Thank you for showing it. Oh, you motherfucker. Nope. Can I get behind you? Yes, I can. But I still with my attack, god damn it. 
Okay, let's get my stamina up. Okay, now I can kill you. Hopefully. Nope. Okay, this is where the range of this weapon is proving to be a problem. But now you're done. Oh, one more. Okay, now you're done. Thank you. Okay, let's deal with the next one. Which one of you wants to... Okay, that one. Cool. Okay, so you come here, please. Hopefully... Okay, how many more are they? Three more. Okay, stupid thing. Okay. okay, so three heavy attacks, back to back, it should be enough to kill them. Okay. That one's coming next. I'm it's I'm sorry that I'm taking this like so I am taking them slowly, but I don't want to deal with the bullshit, so nothing else to do, right? Okay, fuck you. One more. Okay. Blam. That one's coming next. But this is why I play like Fate Bills and I have like Lightning Lightning Spear with me. To deal with, with this kind of situations. Okay. What are you gonna do next? What are you gonna do? Okay, you're fucked. Bye bye. Okay, so just one more and we should be done with these things. Oh, you disgusting things. Fuck you. I love the uppercut thing. <laughs> okay, so now we should be able to get this done. Let's get use as humanity. Let's get power within. And that dude is pretty much the master of magic, so I guess lightning will be the most effective thing. So let's try it. Hi, dude. Sid the Scaleless. The little dragon bitch that betray everything else for power. Did I... Did I not do damage or what? Oh, the crystal. Yeah, forgot. Sorry, sorry, I forgot about the crystal. Okay, come here, jackass. Come on, come here. Is this important to you? Do you want this? Really? Oh, shame. <laughs> what a shame. Okay, let's... Let's have the smackdown. Oh, crap. Okay, close. I kind of see his... Okay, he's gonna explode. Looks like an explosion. Yep. Okay. Close. Let's get more lightning. And let's go there. Let's go once again. Uh, another explosion. No. I'm punching. Like, I, wa I was going to say, like, I'm punching his dick, but the way this looks, it might be right, so. Uh, Perhaps I want to say that. Oh, come on, stay, stay still. Oh shit, oh shit. Okay, we are real close. Let's heal up real quick, and one more hit should be enough. Okay, that's a laser. One, two, and he's down. All right. See, the scale list is dead. Okay, he's so just was jumping around because I'm <laughs> I like the animation so much. All right, so Rocky Balboa, once again, the victor of the challenge. Amazing. Ooh, and 60,000 souls. That is not a small reward. Can I get... Okay, I can get a couple levels. But let's get text, and let's go ahead and warp. 
Oof, I'm guessing to the catacombs, actually, to get to the final thingy. Okay, let's kick some skeleton ass. We're going to the spooky area now. Let's go. Now there should be like a bunch of bone wheels here, but I'm just gonna run past everything here because I don't want to deal with their bullshit. Be careful, just run, 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 doesn't matter. Are they coming? Yeah, they are. Okay. Run, 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 run. And drop. And we should be fine in this area. I just, if you don't remember, this is where we fought Pinwheel. This is like the giant sarcophagus thing. It's, it's actually really cool. And now, okay, now let me think, how are we going to do this? Because I could use a skull lantern to, So we can actually s watch where, where we're going Still, I'm a little bit afraid of the dark Around here And in look at those eyes, right? That looks ominous And it's because there is a massive skeleton right there Is there anything important around here? I don't think there is. Beside, again, giant skeleton. Let's get out of the way. Mm, giant skeleton again. So fuck this. And there are like giant skeleton archers. A bunch of giant skeletons. When I say a bunch, it's actually a bunch. And now... We should be close to the bonfire. Yep. Yeah. Here it should be. Let's go. Well, and over here. We have our first bonfire in the Tomb of the Giants. Let's rest up real quick. And let's continue. Oh man, okay, let's, let's see something. Now we have to... We have to have Patches do his thing. Ah, let's go. But that's the dude that we found in the catacombs, and now he's gonna give us a surprise. He said, hey, they salute over there, and he takes the chance to... It's funny, it's not a stab on the back, it's a kick in the ass. You're an asshole. <laughs> that's... I mean, he has a... That's a, that's a voice line if, if you need one. That's that was cool. But yeah, we are gonna we can actually we cannot kill him in this playthrough. God damn it, because we need him for because I want to use the mask of the child. Let's listen, listen to them. Oh, we need to to save her now. Yeah, let's see. There should be like two undead dudes around. There is one, or I, are the two? Yeah, there are, the two are right in fr next to the other. Need to be careful here. Oh, careful that they don't hit her, and careful to not fall down. And I cannot see for shit. Oh no, 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 no! That's not gonna happen. Fuck off! Oh shit! No, oh, damn it! I thought that he, I thought I killed him. Okay, fuck you. Thank you very much. And there should be another one... ...around here. Probably didn't move, or...? Oh shit! <laughs> okay, that scared me! <laughs> and we cannot see him, so that's the worst part. Can I back backstab you? That way, at least I can know where you're going to be. Fuck off. Awesome. And once again, one more. Okay, done. Whew. All right, so we we did it. We killed these two dudes. We can tell her that they are dead and she's fine. She's gonna make her way to. It's not going. She's not going to Fatling. I think she goes to the undead church to pray for for the death of his comrades or whatever. And here we have. 
these skeleton dildos. And they are... Look at this. Look at that. What else am I going to call these things? They're dancing like this. That's <laughs> They're funny, but I, I don't want to mess with this thing. So let's get... Let's get the fuck away. And there, we're going to be finding a bunch of those things around. For example, here's one. And they like to hug. Let me heal up. And there are like three more around here. And they have like the frenetic attack or whatever. Okay, careful, careful. Okay, relax. Relax things, please. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we are done with these things. And where should be... There is, should be a, like a place here to drop. And if you're ever lost, you lose your way here, the blue things that appear are also a way to move forward. And they show you the way if you illuminate them with the skull lantern. Okay, so we should be... Now... Okay, no, 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 no. I know where we are now. And there should be a giant skeleton archer over there. In a bullshit fight right here. Why do I say this is a bullshit fight? There are like one, two, three, like six, seven giant skeletons around. And they like they don't like you. They're going to kick your ass. So this is gonna be problematic. Let's see. Okay, I kill one with one plunging attack. Oh, look at that. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> you do not see anything about or where they are, the the attacking animations. You don't see anything if you don't have the lantern. And the lantern is in a shield, so if you have this on, they are still going to kick your ass. What I want... Do I want it, though? I think I, I wanted to see if we can get the... Um, the Divine Ember to upgrade our Holy Fist. I don't know it's, if it is worth it. I really don't think so. And around here there should be like another... Okay, Skeleton Archer. There are a couple of giant skeletons here that impede our progress. Still need to be careful. Okay, I take them out in two hits. Gonna kick my ass. Like, he, kick, he kicked me in the face, dude. Okay. Heal up. Dodge. Dodge that. Okay. Careful with that arrow, and let's go up. Oh, this is the thing. Uh, this place is really confusing. Should be getting that I am gonna get real quick. But uh, here there are, should be like two more skeletons. Yeah. They look like they are smiling. <laughs> One, two... Oh, come on! Drop the ward, fuck off. And there's another one right there! Okay. Punching in the dick, and we are... Should be done with most of the things here. I know that if you... I think this is a wait for, for like, to the beginning of the uh, the area. Let me get this item. This is another soul that I need to level. And we should be... Oh, yeah, I thought that we missed the... I really thought that we had missed the mark there, but we did it. Okay. This is, this is the... pretty much the last actual area with a boss in the game. I mean, there is a... I don't want to say secret, but it's like a hidden boss. We have to kill that for like the very end of the game. Oh, it really didn't have nothing important. Let me just rewatch. Let me just make sure. Let's see. Here, there is nothing, and up here, we should be able to go go back like, to the beginning. Yeah. Like over there, that's the giant sarcophagus, and that's the we follow the lights over there to to get into the tomb of giants proper. So we just made a full 
a full circle around here. Now, is it worth to get the stupid... I don't know. I really want to get the divine... The divine ember. I don't know if it's worth it to have to deal with all these things. There's so many. I'm thinking... Maybe we can do a, su a suicide run. How many rings do I have to kill myself? Okay, I got one more. So what I'm thinking to do is run past the skeletons, get that item, and die. That way I can get what I want and I don't have to deal with the stupid skeletons. But that, you know what, that's what I'm going to try to do. Let's see how that pans out. Probably going to die, but I... gonna give it a try. Awesome, we did it. But if we die now, we really don't care. Okay, we don't care. Okay, the <laughs> this is gonna sound bad, but that's the solution to... That's a way to, to solve this. If you don't want to deal with, with bullshit, just kill yourself. <laughs> don't, please don't. Like, that's horrible to say. It's absolutely horrible. Let's get, let's go back to our ring. And now we can proceed through the level. Let's talk about two patches. Uh, where is the dude? Here. I'm... I cannot get mad at him. He's bold. That's awesome. Yeah, I forgive you. I forgive you, yes. Okay. No, no, go to Filing and be a merchant. Okay, fuck you. Okay, let's continue. Let's go... Now, careful here because these... Ah, oh, those things. <sighs> Damn. That's terrifying, dude. Like, we were talking about having things kill us. That would be one of my worst nightmares. It's like a giant dog skeleton made out of human things. Ugh. <laughs> and the attacks they do are absolutely horrible. Okay, okay. Look at that combo, first of all, and then... Oh. Fuck me. Ah, okay. Stupid dogs. I hate them. <laughs> they are the reason that I am a cat person. I'll, I'll, I'll say it. I am sound by it. These dog creatures are the way, are the, 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 the cause that I do not own a dog. I hate these things so much that I soured my experience with dogs. And you cannot even see what they're doing because they are in the dark. I don't know what they're... What, what happened? He, okay, he fell. Okay. That's a victory and I'm gonna take it. Fuck that. Fuck those, fuck those things. Oof. You know what? I know that this is not like the best thing ever. But I really want... I don't really want to deal with bullshit, so... Where are ya? Oh, there you are. <gasps> oh, fuck. I don't know how didn't I die there. Back step, back step, give me your back, give me your back. You're fucked. Good night. Oh, okay. Okay, they have way more health. And... Did he fail? I think he fell. Okay, another victory. Gravity has taken another victim. Oh, fuck. Am I surrounded by those things now? Yeah, looks like it. Is there a path around here? God damn. There are... Fuck. Let's see. I don't remember if I had to go this way, this way. Okay. That's the attack that I was telling you about. They, they launch towards you like max speed. Okay, one down. 
that's not moving right. No, it isn't. What's around here? Is this a bonfire? There is supposed to be like a second bonfire, but I don't remember. No, this is just an item. And a really crappy shield for that matter. <laughs> Let's see down here. Man, this this area it's complicated to navigate. And I know that's that of course on purpose, but eh. And there's an item. Okay, that's another dog thing. It should be a way past everything. I don't remember I don't remember how. And I think, th okay, this is, should be the way to the bonfire. Yeah, this was the way to the bonfire. Yeah, okay, let's take this. Let's continue. Got, okay, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. This is a dog person, a thingy over there. Okay, uh... It's another dog. Okay, follow the lights. We should be out of this place now. Yeah, we are. Okay, so that that was the worst part of the Tomb of the Giants. Should be it should be a smooth sailing from here. Let's let's go, man. Oh, okay. I shouldn't be oh oh no 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 don't go don't go don't go don't go. No okay, we got it. What you got? Thank you. We shouldn't need the the lantern anymore. So let's get my divine kestus. I also took the liberty to sell all the other weapons that we were going to use, and I also have uh, I'm been working on um, another kestus to to max out just to compare the damage. Okay, we should be fine now. Let's okay. Let's proceed now to the final area and the the boss fight. Oh crap. Die, thank you. They die quickly. We are actually making respectable, doing respectable damage. Like, holy crap. <laughs> Ooh, that was an arrow. Really close. Motherfucking things. Okay, I don't care about you guys, so I'm just gonna... Just gonna roll through my problems. <laughs> now, another area that... If I don't know if this is correct, but I think they actually run out of time around here. Because they are like just like skeleton babies and a bunch of copy paste pink wheels. Okay, but they do a, do a lot of damage and I wasn't expecting that. So thank you, Nito. Thank you, pink wheel. Let's pick your ass. Wait, what? Why are you die thank you and I'm just looking for the um, the upgrade materials that are around here again for the divine cases okay we can just punch these dudes okay I like how it looks oh, oh damn you're not why are you not dead they're surviving but, but, but like a sliver of health holy shit Okay, you can die. It's a one and a two and a three. Three. Okay. <laughs> uh, there's another. Is there another one around here? I guess the one that is below me. And up around here should be. Yep, yeah, the Titan, the white Titan Ace slot. Slab, so we can get the divine cases upgraded to the max now. Oh, he dropped—he dropped me something. Did I drop the masks? Ah, oh, it's another mother mask. So yeah, not really useful for me. I already got that one. So, if, but if you want to drop me the mask of the father or the mask of the child, I wouldn't complain that much about that. <laughs> No? Okay, that's fine. We tried. We, we at least tried. So you guys, please go away from me. Now, this is a little bit of an unfair... Ooh, okay. Uh, okay, white titanite chunk. Don't really need it, but, but thank you. This is going to be an unfair fight. And I'm going to explain why. 
to get into the arena, you have to take damage. Like, there is no way around it. You have to take damage if you want to get into the arena. Now, what I'm going to be doing here is I'm going to be healing with a, with a humanity. We're going to be switching back to the fire to my fist and I'm going to be upgrading with charcoal pine resin. So let's try and pull this off without hopefully without getting absolutely destroyed. That's this cinematic. I'm just gonna let it play it out while I get some water. Okay, cool. And if you remember when when we first went into the catacombs, we saw him already. Like there is a way to make a covenant with him and have the world's grave loaded, but as of now, we're just going to defeat this. We're going to defeat the boss and this is the last one. This is the last boss for the that we are missing for the story. Oh shit. Yeah, I forgot about that. He deals. Oh, come on! Oh, I keep- I fucked up. I fucked up. I- I am fucking up. Let's get the fire fist. As a Mestus. Let's get some humanity popping. Okay. Okay. Okay, dudes. Okay, so let me punch you. Oh! <gasps> Motherfucking assholes. Okay. Let's leave me the fuck alone. Oh man. Okay, careful. Careful here. Oh, really? Really? Okay, that's. This is great. We can have him kill the skeletons. And if they don't get killed, at least I can just punch them. Okay. Hey, Nito. Can you kill that dude, please? Man. We're gonna have troubles in this fight, right? And yeah, we are having troubles now. We're in big trouble, because now we have a big skeleton around. Uh, we need to get this done with. One, two, three, four. Ah, oh, come on! Leave me alone! Hey, that works. Thank you, Nito. Who, who thought that you were actually going to fight me? Fairly. Or at least try to. I don't know. If you're actually trying, but... Oh, man. These dudes are really starting to annoy me, and I'm going to lose this fight. Like, I don't have any healing items, and I got... Ah, god damn. I panicked so much that I, I, I got actually sent to the giant skeleton area. And uh, now I'm fucking dead. God damn it. <sighs> God damn, dude. Let me watch this for a second. Whew. Fuck me. Okay. So, we need to get a plan for that fight because that's not really nice. So, what I'm thinking is how, let's see how many humanities do I have. Oh, I'm sorry. How many souls do I have to pop? So I'm thinking that going to the... Once again. Go upgrade my Holy Fist. Kill the skeletons more quickly with the fist. And that way I can just deal with Nito. And I'm not going to buff unless I kill the skeletons. Because... The... Rainy with Power Dean And all that together, it's really taking a toll. So let's go back to... The Undead Parish. And upgrade the Holy Fist. That way, maybe it will be a little bit easier. Maybe, just maybe. <laughs> Let's go down. Alright. Hi, dude. 
Yeah, I got a brilliant amber. You want it? Take it. But I have a favor to ask you. Uh, please, yeah, upgrade my holy fist. To be here, okay. Do we have enough? Yes, we have just enough to get it to plus 10. Woo! Okay, so that's the... the... the most that we can upgrade our fist. And let me repair real quick my equipment. And give me just one sec, guys, because my cat is trying to get out of the of the room. So let me open the door real quick. I didn't even know he was here, actually. <laughs> Sorry for that. Wait, is there something? Okay. Everything seems fine. I'm sorry, I, I believe that... I thought that it was a, an issue here with the cam. No, it looks fine. I'm sorry. For some reason I thought that my... Or it looks like my camera is not showing up. Weird, right? I don't know. Let's go. Okay, so now we have an advantage in the skeletons. So now we should be able... To make that fight a little bit easier. Let's warp into... we have Tomb of the Giants right here, okay. Awesome. So let's back to it, and... Hopefully, hopefully we're gonna kick Nito's ass. Oh, but we don't have the lights, and we... I believed, I, I thought that we had the other bonfire. Okay, let's get the Skull Lantern real quick. But just, let's just run past everything. But yeah, I didn't know that my cat was here. Holy shit. Like, normally when I, I'm streaming, because they have a... I hate that, those things. They have a tendency to... To get in... Into my desk. And I don't want that... I don't want them to do it on stream, because they can hit the, key, the keyboard or the mouse, or... They normally try to, like... Like, I don't know, like catch my attention? And they mess with the mic, they try to like rub themselves with the mic. I I, I know that they're trying to get my attention, I um, tend to give, in, to give them more of it when I am not streaming, but... In order for... don't have... to not have like technical difficulties because of cat interference, I tend to leave them out of the room when I stream. And I thought I did, but apparently he was hidden somewhere around the room. Oh, that's 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 fine. I I should actually show them to you someday. Maybe I will make a, a YouTube video about my cats, so you can you guys can get to know them. Okay, three hits should be enough to know them. I have two cats actually. I have one. It's a black cat named Dante, and yes, yeah, Dante as a reference to either you can pick you can pick one. You can make. Um, Dante from David Might Cry, or Dante from The Divine Comedy. Whichever of those two, if you pick them, you're gonna be right. Because I used pretty much both names while I, while I named my cats. <laughs> now the other one, it's called Mango. That's a, uh, a Spanish name for a fruit, if you don't know it. Okay, they are shooting their fireballs everywhere. Okay, so now, once again, let's get our... Give me my talisman. Thank you. Our holy fist. As soon as we drop, we get uh, humanity. Still, motherfucker. He's gonna kill me right away, right? Okay, he didn't. Was close. Was close, though. And now, I can just punch these assholes to death. We should be... it should be easier. Yeah, three punches. That's way easier. One, two... Drop the shield, you piece of crap. <laughs> okay, need to right here. So let's buff. Just with fire, just to see the, the damage. I like, like his limping. I, like, I don't know why I like that, that aspect of the design. Uh, am I not hitting him, or...? I'm sorry, what now? 
Okay. What's happening? Oh, shit. Okay, I need to be careful with that with the explosion attack. Okay, that was close. Holy. Okay, another explosion. I need to be careful not to be thrown into the giant skeleton area. Okay, so hitting the, the mantle or the f dead fog around him is not going to do anything, so I need to be punching him directly into the bones. Okay, that's perfect, because that gives me the chance to buff up. Cool. Okay, Nito, you di actually did me a favor. Thank you. And without the skeletons interfering, this is not a difficult fight. Like, not at all. Okay, unless you fucked up like I did right there. Okay, well we are... we're doing it really good. Let's hit him in the ankle. You're gonna explode again. Yep! Oh shit! Like, I thought he was doing to swipe me, but... When I realized that he was kneeling down to make the attack, I was like, oh shit. Punch him right on the skeleton dick. I like the design of this thing, right? Like, see, let's see a bunch of bones, like, stick together. With... Where it could pretty much be defined like dead fog. Like, dead miasma thing. It looks cool. It looks cool as hell. And another thing that I like a lot about him is that... <laughs> hey, lady, thank you. We did it, actually. Without... That's what we needed, like, a way to get rid of the skeletons, but we did it. We have finally done it. We have all the four souls, the, well, the Lord souls. And we can now... Okay, let's wait to the camera. Rocky. Awesome. Rocky Balboa, our boy. Best boxer in all of Lordran. Has taken the final Lord soul. And we're now going to open the way to the final boss. Ah, oh, we can get some levels too. Awesome. <laughs> now, I'm thinking I'm gonna get a little bit more stamina, just in case. I'm 30-30, should be enough for now. Let's repair equipment real quick, and... Let's warp into... Don't we have it here, like the kiln? The guns, paint with the world, blah 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 blah. Okay, apparently we don't have we don't have it. Apparently crying. Let's go. Oh man, we're so close. And we have what, like two hours left? Maybe and I'm gonna sound a little bit reckless here, but maybe we can we can take on the DLC and make it up all today. Oh man, that's that's cool. So let's wake him up. Wake up. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Actually, can't we just, like, do it like this? Yes, we can. Awesome. But I don't need the, the help of that disgusting thing anymore. We can just get into the, the kiln right here. So offer the Lord Souls, and let's watch the final thing. I'm going to warm up because we're going to the DLC and that's gonna be difficult. The bosses in the DLC like are kinda hard. And we have uh four bosses if I'm not mistaken. Cool. So this is the final area of the game. The base game. Just to, just to clarify. This is and let's just do our flips around these stairs. This is the kill of the first flame. This is where, if you want to be a lore freak, this is where Lord Win, the final boss, uh, kindled the flame, rekindled the Age of Fire, and doomed everything to hell, and this is like... the end of the world, like, melted... Look at that. 
there was like a giant explosion of fire around here. And we're going to be facing him real soon. But for now, before lighting up, lighting the flames, we're going to descend to the darkest abyss and defeat the... Oh, we're going to be... We're going to go back in time. <laughs> That's the, way, the best way to describe it. We're going to go back in time. I'm hopefully going to enjoy the design of the, the zones. What, sh what is the quickest way to get there? I'm guessing the Undead Parish? I'm guessing, let's go. Man, we're so close to finish up this game. I should- I, I, I'm probably going to spend this week making plans to... to see what will be our route for Dark Souls 2. And then, I also wanted to... I also am thinking about... The D and D campaign. I, I haven't. I don't think I have talked to you about the D and D campaign today. So I, I, I did mention that I had the final meeting with the last player. And hey, uh, I don't know that guy personally. He's just a friend of a friend. But for what I have been like talking to him and all that, he seems like a pretty chill dude. And I don't. I, if he ever sees this and. I'm going to talk, but please don't take it wrong. Please don't take this like the wrong way or anything. Um, of course, when you're playing D&D and you're creating a character, you know that you have like your story, but you also try to leave like plot holes or things that you that you leave open and the like, yeah, the plots or threads, so the DM can take those open holes those open threads and weave them into the story and like have your character be like a breathing living part of the world right so i don't think that he didn't do it he did it actually and i will I, he told me that he was some somewhat of a writer so the story although of course cliche because the the ending is like based on having cliche characters and all that okay he gave me... Let me get the rusted iron to move faster around here. He gave me a, a story that I kind of liked, and, but now that I have the full story of the four characters, maybe because he's a, I'm a DDM, but I am trying to think a way to weave them all together in a way to make sense, in a way that is interesting to them, but also doesn't break the story that much. I'm, I'm, I am going to be working on, the, on that this week. And I also had plans with him. Oh, I forgot about something. Okay, I'm not gonna do it right now. But I forgot to go out and free login and get a magic weapon out of him. Now, this is the, the entrance to the DLC area, and we cannot enter here without the broken pendant. So, now that we have it, oh, we can also get this real quick. We can get to the DLC. So, the, the, the story of this guy is kind of good. was... Um, again, a little bit cliche, a little bit. Um, it seems like a bit of in the inexperience you can notice about uh, that, that real quick, because the selection of class, race, and background, like they don't like they in in their head because they don't they don't have the they don't play the game they haven't played the game. They think that it makes sense. That they think that they all support each each thing, and. For, for the most part it does, but at the same time, like, multiple things, like, stack up on top of each other, and they, in, on my, in my experience, tends to get in the way. Oh, shit. I need to change real quick. Now we're going to get, like, right out of the bat, here in the, in the DLC, we have a boss fight. Right away. And it's a little change of tempo. This is a really... Look at that. Look at that bullshit, man. Throw air at us. Look at how fast the enemies now react to you. You see? Now, the DLCs are ramp up on difficulty that it takes a little to adjust. 
like these are for Dark Souls 1, there is our fast bosses. Like they are going to punish you for making mistakes, for leaving openings in your in your attack. So it's gonna be it's gonna be interesting to see how a a melee build is gonna take this on. Uh, not a melee build, like a, a fist only build. Yeah, now that I need to run. I'm gonna kick my ass now. Recover my things. And I want to give them put I want to pressure this dude a lot. Oh but the damage that we're doing is kinda good. So we might be able to do this actually. If we don't mess that up as we did. Okay. Okay, I got I got a little scared. <laughs> yeah, I messed that one up. I I did. That was my mistake. But I try to remember his attacks because I don't. I know that I know now that he has the that he lifts and stomps on me if I try to if I dodge early. He has the lightning missile barrage thingy. And when he flies, I think he can throw you like lightning or something. Yeah, he throws like a like a massive lightning thingy. So we need to be quick on our feet around this dude. Are you gonna shoot me with your lightning? No, it's gonna fucking headbutt me. Okay. You have to be careful! Okay. Let me heal up. Let me heal. Let me heal. Let me heal. God damn. Gonna wipe the tail. We can cut the tail and get a weapon out of it, but I. No. I don't want to test my luck. Proceeds to immediately hit the tail. That is a combo. I, I couldn't get out of the way. Holy fuck. God damn. <laughs> You see, just you can feel the ramp up on difficulty on this on this thing, right? Like the bosses don't give you time to breathe. Or at least not as much as they did on, on the base game. And that's cool, I mean I'm all for the difficult challenge. I am just complaining because this is a I just playing the game and I'm just trying to be extroverted about it. Okay. I'm having to get my souls every time, it's kind of annoying. Okay. Yeah, that's the lightning. That dragon is amazing. Can you, can you leave me the fuck alone? Thank you. Okay, let's... Damn it. Okay, let's go. Menacing. Okay. We need to be... Okay, I... That's the thing. I have to be... Damn, the combo again. God damn it. Whew. Hey, SD, thank you for the sub. Thank you so much. Okay, let's... Let's try one more time. <laughs> okay. It isn't hard. I mean, it is hard. Of course, I'm, I'm dying. But I don't feel that it's impossible. That's the thing. <laughs> let's try... Let's try it again. I think I'm gonna just... Forget about the souls and just... Focus on the fight. I don't remember how many souls do I have. Okay, cool. 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 Alright. Oh, that's bullshit. Okay, look at me. 
Really? I thought that I escaped the the Wayne thingy. But probably not. Oh damn, let me breathe. No, it's not gonna let me. He really is not gonna let me breathe. Oh, yeah. I was like, what did it kill me? Yeah, the um, power within. <laughs> my own buff is kicking my ass now. Oh, man. And this is the first boss of the DLC, man. Imagine. Imagine the next the next three. That are considered... One of them is actually considered like the best fight in all Dark Souls. In, taking into account the three games. I don't know if I, if I agree with that. I know that it has... Okay. I'm getting stupid now. Let's go. Thank you. Let's kick some ass. You were here! Um, yeah. <laughs> Let's say something. This is going to... Mother fucking hell. This is going to YouTube, right? And as far as I am being looking into the... The, the fist only challenge... I haven't seen anyone fight the bosses of the DLC, fist only, like just using fist weapons. You're gonna. What are you gonna do? Okay, that works. Okay. Uh. Hey Sint, uh, I know you have been playing like Dragon Dogma recently. Have you already faced a Chimera? I don't know. I, I'm just asking because I, I am curious. That's like one of the most iconic enemies on that game. Thank you. I'm gonna get fucked by lightning. Almost got fucked by lightning. And yep. I got your tail, you piece of shit! Now the poison and the... is really doing a number on me. Nope. Let's heal. Okay, we're getting... we're getting better. Slowly, but we're getting better. Oh, shit. That's the stupidest combo. No, no, stop that. I know I can enter and, and try to punish that, but I am so afraid that I am not willing to, to risk it. Oh, damn, bro. You annoying critter. Fuck you. Okay, that's the way to punish it. I know I remember. I remember. Okay, no, 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 no. Not worth it. Okay, let's heal up real quick. And let's kick. Okay. Headbutt. One more. Okay, one more, one more. I thought that was a hit. Okay, dude. Just one more hit. Come on. Okay, one more hit from me, not from you. Oh, you... M what a bullshit move! Come on! Okay, fuck you. <laughs> and let me... Let me get out of here, please. Okay. Oh, damn. <laughs> now, yeah, but I was... You were fucked by a werewolf. Wait, Dragon's Dogma 2 has werewolves? That's cool. Okay, that, that's cool. But... I mean... 
dumb 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 thing right but i i am trying not, not to picture you actually being you know fucked by a werewolf <laughs> i'm trying my best but i i am i am not doing it <laughs> okay let's repair everything let's talk to the mushroom lady hi mushroom lady how are you look at this one from what i'm ugly as fuck is very human indeed, but not in time. That means that I'm a wee because I don't take a bath. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. Big mushroom people, yeah. She's asking us to save the princess. Pretty normal stuff. Let's get this. She gave us. She sells uh, some Ulas Hill illusion magic that we are not gonna be purchasing. Let's reverse the Halloween. Let's kindle to have 10. Okay, thank you. To have 10 Estus flasks. And we're going to be proceeding into the next boss. I don't think I'm gonna go get the items on this area, pretty much because we have a full, a full build already. Like we are done with our with our character. The only thing that we have is either pumping like health or stamina and pretty much that's that however i'm going to show you look at this this is the forest like we're 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 back in time right and right now we are at the royal wood and this is where this is the dark root garden and basin combined and the three the three guys that we fight there are the gardeners, these things. I need to be careful because they have so, so much range. Thank you. And you can get the weapon, that's like a, like a spear thingy. And if I'm not mistaken, the, the heavy attack of that one makes, makes you like face plant, face plant to, the, to the ground like... And you fall, and you fall completely. <laughs> Oh no. Yeah, no, I don't want to deal with this with this area. Let's continue. Let's just run past everything. Now the stone golems that we find like normally. Here they have like a massive like power up version. Look at them. Look they are the one over right there. They do a buttload of damage. And right, let's see if I can show you the their their like massive, like fuck off attack. Not that one. That one is just a normal hit. <laughs> but it does a butt ton of damage. But they have attack that they. I hope they're going to be. They're going to use. Please use it. Please use it. Come on. Okay, he, he doesn't want to do, to do it for me. But pretty much what happens is. He... Okay, he's gonna... Look at that. Ah, oh, Dude. Okay. So, they slam the axe into the ground. And they pull it out with so much force. That they create like a, like a tiny little earthquake. It's so cool. Now, this is where the, the bridge in... Where we have the cat... The cat covenant... Is. That is like a massive... Coliseum, and we're going there. We're gonna be there. And I scattered around this area. You can get the the stone armor set, the the one for the stone golems. Here it should be like a like a piece. Yeah, the gauntlets. I mean, it's fine. I don't like the the being dirty. As the, oh, fuck off! Gravity, why? Why is this always gravity? <laughs> Uh, Sent. If you if you if you send a message like Jump King, please, please don't. Oh, do you know what? Do it. Do it because I wanted to. I wanted to show it in the in the in the in the clip. God damn it. <laughs> okay, let's let's try again. Let's go get our souls back and let's continue to this zone. Oh, hi, dudes. No, I don't care. 
Stay away. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, Santa, now that I that I have you here in the, in, in the stream, um, I talked to 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 little Double A, and we have the character down. Now it's gonna be funny because, like, it shows that you you two guys are friends because you picked somewhat of a similar archetype in their in your characters. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be real, real fun. And I know that. Okay, just to, to clarify to the rest of the audience, uh, the ones that are. Oh, well, I hope that you're currently viewing. If not, then uh, what are you doing? Please, please concentrate. We're, we're doing magic here. We're, we're doing progress. We are making history here right now. Because, again, and I don't know, I might be mistaken, but this is the first time that I've seen a just fist only run taking on the DLC. I know that we're not going to take all the DLC because, again, I'm not going to go for every single item. I'm just going to kill the bosses. I'm talking about bosses. Hello, Calamite. Hi. I'm gonna kick your ass. I'm going to kick the, that dragon's ass. Hopefully by the end of this stream. <laughs> Hopefully. I'm, I'm not getting. I'm not doing any promises, but I am gonna try my best. And you little thing, please. Oh, you're not gonna. Thank you. Okay, I didn't, I didn't need to hit him with, like, do I, like, a knee attack with him? Come on. It's a brutal little animal. Oh, these guys suck. They have the, um, like, the other ones had the, um, the spears, but this has, they, they have now scissors. And they do, again, a bunch of damage. <laughs> so, again, I'm just going to run past everything, and... Pretty much the sort of DLC that, if you can see it here, is the corruption of the abyss, like the darkness thingy, that is slowly getting through the forest and slowly getting to the kingdom. Okay, stop. Okay, oh, damn. that's the attack that I was talking about. Oh shit. Okay, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Oh, that for soul item. <laughs> leave me alone. These are. You can see that these are the predecessor for the. Um, the three guys, because they are annoying as hell. I know that it's a crystal lizard there, but I am not gonna risk it. And I know this here is an item. Which one are you? Another soul. Okay. Just getting interesting, getting the soul items. And I am gonna deal with this bullshit. I'm just gonna get into. Let's go to the Coliseum. Right here. Okay. Is there a shark? I believe that it's a shark around. Try to remember where I think it's around here. And this is I don't know, people debate that this dude is like a I hear a dog. I think they are below. Yeah. This dude is like a like a bloodborne reference. Hmm. Ah, let me guess. Snatched by a shadow limb and dragged off to the park. Yes. Exactly what happened to me. We are both strangers in this strange land. But mm. at least now there are two of us. That's Willy Wonka. Uh, okay, look at the the, the the mask, right? Look at the, the creepy smile. That is a Willy Wonka that I don't want to have like near me for any amount of time. I don't know that the, the real Willy Wonka was also kind of like a funky dude. But look at that. That's creepy as hell, man. <laughs> so, long. so, if this guy gets to you and offers chocolate, don't take it. Absolutely, don't take it. <laughs> and let's get past this horrendous thing. And, okay, this is where I died. As you can see, this is where I the gravity did these things and, and killed me. But we have now a shortcut. We don't have to go all the way around the forest. And I am thinking, and Chad, let me know if you if you agree with me. Do we kill this dude? And the reason for it is because I like the armor. I like the the 
this the armor set for this dude. So I am thinking to kill of killing him. So he can no longer offer real like weird candy to children. So I'm gonna try it. Or maybe ah, maybe later. You know, maybe later. Because I just want to get to the boss fight. So I'll I'll kick your ass soon enough. And in here you have like a chasm. This is where like the river, the 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 hydro thing. That wasn't chocolate, dude. Oh, ow, uh. I knew, I knew that I couldn't, I couldn't trust that guy. So you know what? Let's kill him. He tricked me. He told me that was chocolate. God damn it, Willy Wonka! Why did you do this to me? Fuck you. Yes, come to blows, asshole. Well, the bullshit part is that he has a crossbow. <laughs> Look at that bullshit. And, okay, the, the crossbow that he has actually has a, like, a real cool move. That one, like the, the, the low kick. Fuck you. you win, please. Oh, please. Have mercy. You tricked me, that wasn't chocolate. No mercy for ya. Give me your, give me your armor. Okay, let's get humanity to heal up and let's go to what I said. This is what I was talking about. This is supposed to be the best fight on Dark Souls. Dark Souls 1 for sure. And Dark Souls as a trilogy, there are people that think that this is the best fight. I don't know if I agree, but it, it really is a really, really good fight. Let's get our flip ring because we're, gonna, we're for sure going to need it. Let's take this out let me let me okay our armor is worse and this is more heavy well, we should be but look at that we look cool as fuck we take this with the creepy no i don't like the smile uh, no 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 you know it reminds me of like this is it was like this movie like the black phone or something and the the mask of this dude reminds me of the poster for that for that movie you know, let's do something more stylish. Let's go for this hat. Awesome hat. And let's see my weight, just to make sure that we are not foot rolling. Now we're we're ninja flipping. That's a, that's that's good stuff. Okay, so let's go power within. Get our buff up. And let's kick some dude. Let's kick Sir Artorius, the Abyss Walker. Ass. And don't tell me that isn't a good intro. Oh, damn. Look at that. Welcome to the best fight of Dark Souls 1. Let's see the damage. Okay. Close there, fella. Nope! I fucked up. I really... I evaded that so early. Let's heal. He's gonna punish. Okay. Okay, we're good damage-wise. Okay. Nope. Now, the lore of this dude is like, he was like the bravest, most awesome knight of the, of the kingdom. Oh. And he slapped me with his... He went here to fight, like, the corruption, the darkness, whatever. He got absolutely corrupted and destroyed. He got his his good arm broken. He's actually left-handed, so props, props to the left-handed people. I am left-handed, by the way. Oh, okay, stop slapping me, dude. Shit. Yeah, got got cooked. Uh, okay, 
We need to adjust to this guy now. But yeah, like he got corrupted by the Abyss. He got absolutely destroyed, and now he's like a hollow... Like a husk of his former self. And... I mean, it's a shame that the, the Dark Souls lore is so, like, obscure and all that. Because it will be... It will be really, really cool to have, like, a cinematic... I don't know, like, a, like a movie thingy about the different knights and the lore of this game, because it's, it's actually really good. I'm not gonna lie, it's re really, really good. Um, I have, I, I know a, a, a YouTuber is kind of, kind of big, it's, I want to remember, like, like the biggest Dark Souls lore guy. Uh, Buddy Villa, I remember now, it's Buddy Villa. And that dude has literally made hundreds of I, I want, I'm going to adventure and say thousands of videos talking about the lore of this game and the way that he he narrates it looks it makes it sound like so somber, so cool, so like it, it, it feels like a really good fantasy story because it is. But being like having it narrated to you, it's like a it's a really nice experience because he really puts into perspective every single ap aspect of this game and the amount of love the, the developers had for it. Okay, enough geeking around about the Dark Souls lore. Let's take let's take this fight. Let's go. And the funny part is that if you enter when you enter the arena, the, the body that he he killed is right at the at Punch up. Go back that go back. Let me, just because I don't want to lose those souls, let me get those real quick. Oh shit. Gotta be careful because I don't want to get slapped, because that slap, that little interrupt, really does, does some damage. Okay, that's... Okay, that got me by surprise. Haha, <laughs> better the boss fight. Uh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> need to get better. I need to get absolutely better at this boss fight. And I mean, you can see, you can see that the game changes a little when you're fighting when you're fighting this dude. Like it isn't, like, it doesn't feel slow and clunky anymore. It's like I don't know, it feels so good. It feels really, really good to fight this guy. Although we have been doing a poor job <laughs> at doing so. We need to. Get, we need to. Focus again. Oh shit! I just love how to how this looks like. Being like -lo 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 -lo, in the forest, like trying to evade everything. Uh, okay. Now, uh, Sent, if you if you if you were so kind as to because I I got I still am curious about this. Um, was the werewolf fight like a like a boss fight or is it like a normal? Enemy type that you can you can find in Dragon Sogma too. I guess I'm gonna get I'm gonna know that by, for myself real quick because I am planning to, to play it. I don't know maybe maybe on Mon on Monday or Tuesday or something. I'm gonna oh Monday is actually tomorrow so yeah I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, I'm gonna try to stream it to stream Dragon Sogma and see how good of a game it is. Everyone is praising it. Well, those who can actually play it are, are pressing it and I am one of the lucky ones actually <laughs> you come here fuck you okay this is way better I need to get back I need to retreat when he does that oh no 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 you're not gonna do it you're not not no 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 there, there's, you can actually try to to prevent him from powering up. You need to knock him, knock it out of it, but it's not really easy. Oh damn it! Ugh, it wasn't worth healing right there. Give me, give me just one. Okay, thank you. Okay, or maybe not. Up. Back, 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 back. Oh, damn it. And I'm cornered. 
Okay. I am really on the defensive on this one. Okay. Should be we should be fine. Okay, now we are a little bit better. Okay, careful, careful. God damn it. No, I fucked up. I really fucked up. I was just walking and then I was summoned by wolves. Here, how I was the boss bar, so I wouldn't assume it was. Yeah, the boss bar. A boss bar. Okay. Okay, la, 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 that sounds cool. That really sounds cool. Because I've I been. Mean, I. For what a little I saw of Dragon's Dogma, like the trailers and all that. I'm curious because I, I don't remember actually seeing a werewolf, but I know that it's like a like a sphinx kind of thing, and it looks so cool. It looks so evil, like like a bird woman. It looks really really nice, and I really want to try. Like I really want to know what's that's going on. Like what's that about, right? It looks like um yeah, it looks like a somewhat of like sphinx, like the 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 the, the Egypt thingy. I don't know. It should be it should be fun to fight and like I know that and you you didn't I don't I believe that you didn't, didn't play the first Dragon's Dogma, but um okay I need to be sure that this guy doesn't stop me when I get down the elevator. Okay, thanks. Let me send this back up because I'm probably going to die again. Okay, I want, I mean I'm curious to see the the. The amount of, of enemies and the different kind of enemies that were gonna have in that game. Because in the first one we had like chimeras. They were cool, actually cool things to to fight. Because they had like the serpent, the, the, the snake tail, their goat head and the lion's body. And depending on what you like damage first. The, the, the fight was going to be changing a little. Okay, let's go. Need to be more... Ag a little bit more aggressive. Motherfucker. That attack has, like, no animation, dude. And that's the best time to heal, I guess. Okay. If I don't get, like, absolutely demolished. As I am doing right now. Holy shit, dude. Oh shit. Now he's trying to to combo the things. That I was Yeah, that was a sign for the slab. Can I get you out of this? Probably not. Let's get back. Heal. Probably he's going to kick my ass now. Dude, that that move, that move has like so little time to re to react to it. He's doing it again. Ah, damn. Oh, boy. This is gonna be a fun one, that's for sure. Ugh. So yeah, like if you if you cut the tail of the Chimera on Dark Souls One, yeah, they, uh, they the thing had like a poison attack and it wouldn't be able to do it anymore. If you kill the goat head, it will stop her the thing for casting magic, and hurting the lion of course was like hurting the main the main body. There also was a fight with the with. Like cyclops, like giant cyclops. It was cool because you could you could climb on top of him and like repeatedly stab the the thing in the eye. Kind of see if maybe having a little bit more poise would help me like survive the attacks. Or at least not get knocked out of every single thing. 
one other boss fight that I remember on Dragon's Dogma. The Griffin was actually kind of cool. Like, it, it would be flying around everywhere, and while fighting the Griffin, I was thinking, like, hey, I, I want to... I wanted to be playing like a, like a mage character because it was so annoying that he was out of reach because he, he flied. Oh, and Senta, let me ask you again. Um, which class are you playing Are you playing in Dragon's Dogma? Are you playing... I'm guessing that you're playing a mage, but... I want to see, because I know that Kuro will be playing like an assassin character. So I, I was thinking that maybe I should get either, like, to, to compare experiences, right? I could be playing like, either a warrior, like a fighter kind of thingy, or maybe I, sh I could make me make myself an archer. Kung Fu Archer? Really? <laughs> so that- wait, 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 that's what you're playing, or...? Okay, okay, oh, oh shit, I forgot the buff. So now we're playing. Now we're being dumb. Damn it, okay. You can fuck off. Okay. Oof. I was able to see so, so, to see that one coming. Oh, that's nice. You're gonna buff? No, you're gonna attack. Cool. Oh, second one. Cool. You're gonna buff, right? Yeah, you're doing the the buff thing. So let me buff up as well. Let me heal. Oh, let me heal, man. Thank you. Bullshit. Wait, what? What was that, man? Oh, damn. Is it difficult to get letter the assassin? No more archer, but uh, I can kick and do this, so... So, okay, you're playing an archer. Okay, so that opens the way for me to play a mage. That 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 interests me actually. And Kuro, how, um, tell me about your experience with with the, with the game with Dragon's Dogma. Has it been? Are you playing for a while? Have, what what crazy things have you seen so far? Because I don't know if you saw, but assassins have sword and shield, daggers and bow. So they got pretty much everything, right? So it's like the first one. They they got everything. Because I know the class- there is another class, right? There are, there are two classes that interest me. The mage? Because I, I remember that the- in the first one, the mage has like some very big and um, bombastic spells. So I'm trying to see, like, maybe with this new, like, graphics and all that, it will be- it should be looking, like, absolutely gorgeous. And I know that there is, like, another- oh, you piece of shit. Thank you. Ooh, thank you for the, the the moss. Okay. And I know that for the second one, you get like a some sort of I don't know how they call it, like a like an illusionist kind of thing. For for what I saw, it's like you can have the the monsters fight each other or something like that. That is interesting, but it looks like more as a, like a support character. So I think him if you guys are playing that I'm going to go I'm probably going to go for a mage. Mother of No! Okay. Heal up. Okay. Okay, there was a slap. The overhead. No! Oh. Okay. No shit. I fucked that up real bad. Oh, you're gonna punish me for healing. Almost. Okay, but that's... A... Now it wasn't so far. Ah! <laughs> God damn it! The first one, it was three initial classes. If I'm not wrong, the next in the new one are four. Yeah, because the uh, in the first one, like the assassin and archer, well, yeah, like the rogue character and the and the archer character were pretty much the same. 
And in this one, they they separated them. So yeah, they, I think there are four. And I remember, and on the fir on the first Dragon's Dogma, because I I've been playing it for a, in a while now. That actually the assassin, like the yeah, I think it was the assassin, was like the most overpowered thing ever, because if you build it correctly and have the correct stats. It will do like an insane amount of damage in s and like hit so quickly because he has like a flurry of blows attack or something. And I remember seeing a clip of a... I don't know if it was a speedrunner or, or, or anything like that. But it was a dude that was... Well, of course played really well and had, uh, had a lot of like, experience. I know this, this is like a beholder... Like kind of thing in, in Dragon's Dogma. That it was like a boss. It was like a huge bowl of tentacles, and he has like a big eye in the center. And what they did, the, the dude did was pretty much like he jumped into the eye and started slamming the daggers around him. He was flailing like crazy, like he was stabbing, 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 stabbing. And uh, in Dragon's Dogma, the, the, the enemies have like, like many, many health bars, and you have to go and, and deplete every single one of them to kill them. And the dude was like shredding to every single hell bar in like just and spamming the move like crazy. And it I think that was like a like a DLC boss like the beholder thing. And he killed it like in minutes. I I, I want to say minutes because I I, I I don't want to say seconds, but it, it it felt like seconds. He killed it so fucking quickly that oh damn. I, I, I thought at that moment that I, sh I chose the, the wrong class because on Dark Dragon's Dogma 1, I played a warrior. And yeah, they did a lot of damage, but they took a lot of damage as well, so... I don't know if it's really worth it. Okay, now I can predict that attack, but that one is really fucking awful. Power up? Yeah, power up. Okay, so... That's the, that's the thing, we're not doing bad damage. Oh man, that was unfortunate. Now we're back at the defensive, because we really need to survive. One more attack to heal. Awesome. Oh, shit. <sighs> Man, we have the damage to do it. I just need to suck less. <laughs> How is my things? Uh, they are a little bit hurt, but not so bad. <sighs> shit, 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 shit. Okay, let's let's go. Let's continue real quick. Ah, and that this is a wall. Like we have to either beat this guy or go home without the prize. So we will be hitting ourselves against this wall until we go past it. <laughs> shit! 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 Okay. I saw an assassin class in not going to be in Dragon Summer too. So they are not going to have the assassin, but they had like a they had like a similar thing, right? Warfarer. And that wait, which one is Warfarer? The um, the one with the because um, I know there is one like a with twin blades and it does like a, some sort of ice magic thing. That 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 also looks cool. Is that the Warfarer? I'm not really sure. Or is it like? Rogue. Hmm. And I'm really sure. That, that's what I want to play this game, man. That's really what I want to play, because I, I want to know, I want to experience the game. Oh, crap, I... Okay, let's go again. Cool. Okay, let's... Let's see if we can get this, man. So, once again, chat, I'm going to... I'm feeling like I'm going to ask for your help on this one. I need your power. I need you to actually pray for me to finally defeat this dude and
He's gonna slap me, that's fine. They're gonna power up, yeah. That gives me a chance to heal. I heal twice just in case. Hmm, okay. I thought he was going to come for me faster. Why can I not dodge to the left, dude? Come on. Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit, man. Whew. Okay. Okay, Arturius is not... It's not going easy on me, man. You can do it, you can do it, but I'm only human. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no, I'm losing faith. The chat is losing faith on me. No, 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 no. That can't stand. That won't stand. We're gonna, we're gonna, kick, we're gonna kill this boss. You're gonna, we're, you're gonna see it. We're gonna... You know what? Let's do this. I'm, I'm gonna give you a promise right now. We're not going to only kill this boss. We're gonna finish the DLC. We're gonna finish the DLC today. <laughs> That's a promise. I won't leave this chair until we get that boss completely... This game completely done. Because, let's be honest, once the DLC is done, there isn't really any other trouble to face. So let's... What do you think, chat? Would you, would you would you like would you like that? Would you like me to Yeah, completion. Like I'm going to f the last enemy the last bosses that I need is are Artorias, Manus, Calamit, Windolin, and and our, um, the final boss, um Lord Win. Let me check that real quick, just to make sure that I, I have that correctly. Because uh, I have the list of bosses on the other monitor, so I'm just going to make sure that I have killed every single boss in this game yes so that's the only things that we are missing we're, so you're, we're missing what five bosses the warfare can equip all weapons oh crap okay no no that's yay okay so i'm gonna make that promise and i hope i'm, go I'm not going to eat my words <laughs> but yeah i am going to finish this game today because chat is being so cool today and in the, la in the last couple of streams that I really want to to make this a performance of a lifetime but let's do it chat let's fucking do this You piece of crap. Yeah. <laughs> like, he can combo for days. Yeah, there's another class called Tricksters. Yeah, that's the one that I'm thinking about. I think that's the one that I'm thinking about. The one that actually, like, can make the enemies fight each other. Correct me if I'm wrong about that. But I think that's the one. And I don't know, they look cool, but they, they use, like, some sort of... Um, like incense burner they look they look that looks nice actually that looks really really nice so yeah maybe that maybe i can i don't know I, I don't want to do that because i really feel that's like a, just a support character and that will mean that the the pawns will have to do the killing and i will be just there like buffing the party and all that I don't know. Oh, well, what what have you seen, Kuril? Um, is the car, is the class, like, entertaining to play? Because I, I feel like it will be, like, very, very focused, uh, like, support-oriented. So I don't know if that's, that's what I want to do. What have you seen about the class? Okay, let's... Okay, I'm going to, I'm going to try to concentrate on this fight, because god damn... This suit has truly been kicking my ass. And, okay, maybe we can do something. And I don't know if this is going to be worth it. Hopefully not. 
but let's see if we can make this the same as when what we did with the um, let's see something like this like we're gonna tank through it pretty much I don't know if this is gonna be the best strategy but let's let's give it a try we're gonna try and tank through Artorias. And I know, this sounds like a little bit of bullshit. Yeah, I don't feel good about this. I don't like this. Yeah, this is this, this doesn't feel right, right? I mean This is not fun. <laughs> We're bullying this dude now. So just to make just to show you that it's possible to kill this dude. As we are doing right now, I do not feel like I don't feel this is earned. I don't really feel this is learned, so now I don't feel It seems like a support role, but it seems funny, like the white mage from Final Fantasy XIV. Okay, so it's like a healer type of deal. Hey, it could be, it could be fun. Not gonna lie, it could be fun to, to play with. Uh, what, what, okay, let me, sh let me remember again what armor do we had. We had this, we had this stupid mask. The other stupid mask. This, this, and... The tight, they were black tights. Yeah, yeah, that's what we have. But I don't know. I mean, we could we could tank through it with with Havel's armor, but I don't feel like that's like a mastery of the game, you know. Like using Havel's armor for the most part looks like it feels like cheating because you can tank through any attack that the. the that this the the bosses can throw at you, and I don't know. I don't. It didn't feel well. <laughs> I'm gonna try it like this. I'm gonna try it like this and see if I can actually learn the fight. Try to avoid it and all that. If we if we have let's give it a, like half an hour. I'm gonna give myself half an hour to to learn this fight and to be able to 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 do it. If I am not able to do it, then I'll. Just do it with Howl's armor. And just tank, tank through it. Let's see, man. Let's see. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> okay. Try not to suck. Let's try not to suck. Let's go. It's gonna go buff, I'm gonna go heal. Okay, dude. Come on. Damn it. Okay. Can I dodge at least? Thank you. I need to be careful now. the overhead oh okay so we're getting we're getting better at dodging the attacks Oof, the only problem the only problem is that the 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 backs the back slashing I don't know roundhounds attack and that overhead like I tried I dodged it so early that it was I really got punished for it Okay. God damn, man. 
I got the seal ring. That's also a problem. Let's get the hornets. That sorry, the wolf ring. One hit had yeah, <laughs> yeah. That is the problem that um, I focus myself so much on having like the right amount of damage that I am feeling that I'm I really don't have enough health. So what I'm thinking is that all the levels that we get in the DLCs are going straight to to vitality, man, because we are made of pretty much like hopes and dreams, so we break absolutely easily. <laughs> oh damn. You know what? Let me let me try in as we did with the Battle of Chaos. Let me just Let's see if I if I focus on the fight and stop talking for just a little. Let's see if I'm able to do this bullshit. Okay, Artorias, so show me what you got. That's weak. That's not. I can see shit. <laughs> Artorias, come on. Come on, dude. I knew there was a second one coming. Okay, that's two hits, two free hits, one heal. Oof, okay, that was close. You're gonna slap me, dude. Come on. Okay, that was the overhead. Ah, damn it. Whew. Need you to jump. Thank you. Damn. Um... Okay, that was a little silly that I didn't connect. Damn it. Another buff. Okay. We already ran out of both of ours, so... This is gonna hurt like a truck. Look at that bullshit, man. <laughs> Damn it! Whew. Okay. That was half life. I think we really need to interrupt the, the buffs, man. We really need to try to interrupt that because it's not worth it, man. Like, if he gets buffed, we pretty much... Like, the second buff, he, he does our entire life in one hit. So we really need to either not let him buff or interrupt the buff, no matter what. Need to be... Oof, man, we need to be on point on this fight. And let's be real. Um, although this is a, a very difficult fight, a, um, the last two are... I will say that they are way more difficult just because the enemies hit like like trucks, like, like a whole train station like running, running and hitting you in the face. Like They are, do so much damage damage that I'm wor I'm actually worried that we're going to get one shot at okay once again damn 
down. Okay, half a life there. What are you gonna do? You're gonna double that? Not really. Yeah, he doubled it. Damn it. Just when I he tripled it. Holy shit. Let's guess let's get out of there. Let's heal. I'm not gonna I'm gonna try and not let you buff up. This one. Okay, that's cool. This one. No, I'm not gonna let you. Fuck you, dude. Now we can. Oh, we did it. We did it. We did it. Okay. Cool, 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 cool. No. Did we do it? He's not buff, right? I'm sorry. I'm sorry if I am so quiet, but I really want to focus on the fight. Motherfucker. Bullshit. He's gonna buff? No. He's gonna just jump. Humanity heal. Great. Damn, bro. Ugh, that attack is so much bullshit, dude. No, we are not gonna let this good dude buff up. I will also really punish the attack. Bullshit. One, two. Heal up. Okay, dodge that perfectly. Dodge that by a really stroke of luck. Let me buff real quick. No, okay. Nope. I am not gonna let you. I will not let you. Okay. Okay. Fuck me. I got that one. What are you gonna do now? Okay, I'm gonna heal on your face. Really wasn't worth it, but it's fine. One. Not gonna happen, dude. It's not gonna happen. Forget about it. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I need your faith now, okay? I've proven myself that I can beat Artorias with fist only. So that at least merits a follow. <laughs> so if you're if you're watching me on Twitch, give me a follow. If you're watching me on YouTube, subscribe to the channel because we fucking did it. And everyone in the chat can say I was here because you were here. You beautiful people. <laughs> we did Artorias, man. We did it. We did it. We took what many will consider the best fight in the game with just our fists. <laughs> man, that feels like a really nice accomplishment. If I haven't had Rocky say hi to you guys in the chat, it's because I wanted to have it in a better lighting soon. Thank you, Rocky, for being so awesome. Oh, thank you, Kuro. Thank you for... It was hard. <laughs> what did you want me to say? It was it was really hard. I, I really had to concentrate, so I'm sorry if I, I was uh, like... So... So quiet during the fight, but... You, you saw the, the need for... Or the change when you finally can... You concentrate on the fight and... Oof, we beat... His ass. Holy moly. But yeah, I think that's the key to the fight. If you let if you let Artorias buff, there is, is you're fucked. Like the, the damage ranks up ranks up so much that 
I don't think it's possible. <laughs> so maybe we can go and level up one more time. Again, let's try to buff our health now. And now we have to defeat the weird... What's it, what are they called? Like, Ula Seal Sorcerers or whatever the name is. Now, um, I don't know if you have ever saw the DLC of Dark Souls. But this is... This is the city that is slowly sinking into the darkness. I don't think this city is, exists no more. This is the actually the lost land of Ulas Hill. Or something like that is the actual name of it. And I think I fucked up because I thought I could sneak around this, these things. But apparently not. So I will probably get wrecked. And that's the... Okay, the Ulas Hill mage. There is a bunch more dudes here. Just want the item. Give me the item, and I will die peacefully. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, that is not a good idea to just. If I'm going to get the items, I shouldn't leave those guys alive or try to sneak past them. But they are so disgusting. I and you can you can actually have like they can drop the hat and you can you wear it, and it looks sick. It looks like this like red eyes. Blob. Oh! Speak of the devil, right? Look at it. Let's have a real look at this, at this thing. The bloated head. Look at that. Let me give you more light. Right here. Look at this. I know a lie. I do feel like it looks good. But I don't want to have like a monstrosity head. So let's go back to our little helmet. So I guess I will have to kill these dudes. The good thing is they are, they aren't really that stuff of a monster to kill. Like two hits and they're down. And now that I I am looking at this, they have some massive arms. Holy shit! <laughs> Wait, I, that was in the game, right? The the scream. <laughs> Please tell me that was in the game because I, if not, I'm going to be a little bit scary. Oh yeah, it's in the game. Okay. I forgot that you can you heard the screams of people in this area, but it gives it gives some ambience for sure. Now there is the mage dude and the melee dude, so and they act like monkeys. They they laugh and they're like maniacal. Uppercut to the face, and they're down for the count. Oh, okay, that was a snipe and a half. And you can also get the sorcerer the sorcerer's head. They are like more insect like. Kinda cool. Again. Let's get these guys out. This. And I think I will actually have to get an item to defeat the next boss. Rawr. Whatever that means. <laughs> let's go. Okay, let's go here. Fuck you. Awesome. Oh, they also drop upgrade materials. I didn't, didn't remember that, actually. Now, in here, I think we also... It's the only other use for the Skull Lantern. Was it here? Somewhere around here, there's a use to the Skull Lantern, in which you can... Like, unlock hidden... Like a hidden pet. That Those sounds are very disturbing. Yeah, here it was. Just to make sure that I don't have anything weird around me. And this is the silver pendant, and I'm going to equip that right away, because we're definitely going to need it. This is the item that will allow us, and I'm going to take everything else out of the bag. Just the humanity, and the... Did I... There's... Okay, it's out there. The belly button, the silver pendant. That's the only... That's, the, I think, the only thing that we needed from this... the school lantern, so we can go back to the Holy Gestus. And that's... I think that's the only item that we needed here. There should... There are going to be, like, a couple of, of upgrade materials. And a couple more of the bloated sorcerers. One down. 
Should be a couple more around here. Yep. Two, in fact. Hey, you can catch me. Can't catch me. Eh, the Holy Fist doesn't do that much. But it really helps against... Open chests. They took from us. And we have our first Dark Sorcery. At something that will going to become a staple in the rest of the Soul series. Unfortunately, we will not be able to use it. Uppercut! Bam! Sit down. And here is another sorceress. <gasps> Mother! <laughs> we literally got pushed around. <laughs> God damn it. God fucking damn it, dude. <laughs> okay, we're, we are, we're making progress on the... On the Olasil Township. Let's... Do I need to get there again? I I think I did. I, I think I do, so... <gasps> God damn it. <laughs> you know what? Um, it's a good thing that we we lost those souls and... We remember that we are playing Dark Souls and we need to be aware of where we are or... And where are we landing? Because... Gravity again rears its ugly head. Oh, I hate gravity so much. And actually, now that I think about it, I don't think there's anything around here that we truly need. Let's just continue. Are they coming? Yeah. Ooh, yeah, and there are a bunch, so no, thank you. I will open that chest, but that chest is actually a mimic. Look at the look at the chain. Um, you guys coming or what? Oof, the wolf, the wolf ring is actually being really helpful. So now we don't get staggered that much. Is that one coming or just... Will you push each other out of the stairs? Okay, that works. Oh, that works. Um, one down and the other is slowly getting back up. I'm just going back because I, I don't remember what that item is. And I'm really curious curious about it. Can I just roll through here? I think I can. Yep. Cool. That's the maniacal laughter. It's so cool. And is there anything else that I need around here? You don't remember. Oh, okay, careful. There's Ah! Uh-huh. Stupid thing. Another sorceress. Oh no, actually it's the same. We're back at where, where we started. So this is the other one. Let's see if we can sneak attack it. Did you drop something? Because you're... Okay, she dropped something, but I don't know what it was. Was it a spell, maybe? Um, no. I actually don't remember what she drops, but... We don't need anything else around from this area, so let's get out of here. The problem is I don't remember how to get out. Around here? Yeah, yeah, around here. Okay. This sounds so maniacal, I love it. And this is the way upwards. Cool. Should be getting. Let's see. I'm trying to remember the where we are, or where to go, and all that. Yeah, that's the. This is the way forward. And you can see an ambush right there. There's a guy in that corner, and another one right there. Now let's have some fun and let's kill this mimic. Oh, by the way, the uh, scent. This is a mimic, I know. I believe that you know what a mimic is. So, in our D&D campaign, <laughs> I might have some surprises for you. <laughs> Just to let you know. Oh, okay, the, I got the very good. I forgot what that mimic actually dropped, so... 
Ooh, relax. You disgusting things. Where are ya? Ow, I, rem I didn't remember. There was a caster there, one there, and one right here. And they are all going to try to kill you at the same time. If you progress. If you, like, run past everything. Right, activate this one. I'm gonna take it. Oof, okay, that's a lot of damage. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, spoilers. I mean, you know that I'm actually evil, so I don't know why would you think that I wouldn't do something horrible to you guys on on the D&D campaign. <laughs> I don't know, what, you, what did you expect? Now, this is the, the, the cool part about this DLC. Because now, these creatures, the, the bloated eyes, they will now have, like, red glowing eyes, and they look way cooler, like... I, I, I like the, the, this, the enemy design on this thing a lot. We got actual rubbish. And an ambush. Bam. This is going... This has been a cakewalk so far. So, okay, I say that I am going to immediately die. I look at this room, there's like... A caster here, a dude there, two more there, one there, a caster on top, and two more over there. Like, this is a... this is a trap room. True and true. And I don't think we can jump and kill the sorceress... ...without being... Let's see. Can I... Wait, what? Okay, it luck come to the top. Okay, I'm a little scared, but let's see how can we get it out of this. Oh, really? No one activated? Okay, please. At least you come here. Okay, that sucks. We got actually saved by that column. Because I thought we were going to... We were, I thought that we were going to die. Oh, is there, yeah, there's an item here. They did. Like, look at, look at them. Look at them. They look so menacing. Ooh, that was a lot of damage on my part. And I... No! Okay. Okay. Fuck you. Now, okay, the gaster fell. That's cool. If I just get them to come here, we should be fine. Unless we still got sniped by the spell. Oh shit! Oh fuck, 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 fuck. They do so much damage. I need you to align <laughs> so I can kill you. Like, except that that one escaped. I got no stamina. Okay. Whew. That wasn't easy, but we did it. Fucking hell. Now we need to just deal with the caster and we should be fine. Except that we suck at dodging. <laughs> what else do we have here? Uh, that's the way forward. We have a bunch more of these silly dudes. Damn, those are some nice screams right there. Holy. <laughs> Where... There should be more of these things. I bear, I'm trying to be careful because I know they can surprise us. Okay, there is one. Yeah, do your stupid attack. Fine. Awesome. There is... Ooh. Okay, that's the one laughing. Is there another one nearby? No, I need to go there soon. And I think this is where... I know there's a chest there. How do we get there? It's like a door there, but I don't remember. I mean, that door. Do we have to jump across? Let's try. Nope. No, it's not jumping across. Then how do we get up there? Street, don't remember. Fuck me. Let's go. Let's. We need to get a, a key to the giant blacksmith so he can 
help us kill the black dragon. And that should be all. Okay, you're you're getting on my nerves. Let's let's just gonna dispatch this dude. Where is it? Here it is. Should be able to roll. Yep. Shut up. Thank you. And this is another mimic. So this is another place where you don't you can't trust any single chest. Done. And think he gives me the key. Yeah, the grass key. That should be the one that opens the door to the giant blacksmith. Oh, I knew there was something hidden. Just awful things. And what else is it here? Probably nothing else. Except for this drop. My, okay, they, yeah, there was a secret item here. Forgot. Some humanities. Not worth it, but still. That's... No, that's... Oh, we can't get back, right? We need to... We need to drop. Yeah, let's, let's do it. Now, I can't remember for the life of me how to get to that chest. And it's going to nag at my head, but we need to continue, so I'm going to leave it. And we're gonna get my humanities up. Oh no, I think this is a... Yeah, this is actually a shortcut. Awesome. So we have now unlocked a shortcut from the bonfire to... Like the middle part of the city. And I'm just going to press on to see if I can... Get to the final part of this area. But I need to be careful because I, I got no healing items. And I have a good amount of souls on me. Ah, you bitch. Let's get in here. There are three of them. Well, the, the good thing is that we have them stuck in the in the doorway. So we might be able to funnel. Yeah, we are. They're stuck. Be careful now. Okay, we are done. Two down. Fantastic job. Another upgrade material. Not gonna complain about that. The problem will be this stupid mage. Okay. You whiffed. Okay. I don't know why. They do so much damage. Wait, is there another thing walking around me? No, it should be just the mage, right? Okay. Fuck. Okay. Fuck you. Blooded head. No. We had no luck. There is an Okay, yeah, I remember that there was an item hidden like over here. Now we are going to face I think this is this is like an unique enemy in the in the entire game. I don't remember seeing this dude anywhere else, but he is a bitch to fight. He does a bunch of damage. Look at that. He just graced me. Look at that. <laughs> we got... We get two shot at pretty much every... Every enemy can two shot at in this game, in this area. So yeah, it's not really... It's not really nice. And for that, I guess... Now, I'm gonna try to get past everything here with just five, five Estus. And then I'm going to... ...to kindle the other one. They're of course going to be an, a nuisance. Of course they are. But I'm gonna go down here and hopefully they're not going to follow. And if they do, they're going to probably fall and die. But it works for me either way. Yeah. Figures. Okay, so once again, I'm going to get the mellow ones to come to me. Okay, I, I, I dodged one. At least one. <laughs> Let's heal up. And, oh shit. Okay, now, you are not able to come here. So go away. You too. Thank you. 
now we need to get, be careful with the wizard, with the sorceress ladies. Let's... Okay, she's going back, so I can just punish that. Um... Excuse me, what? <laughs> I'm sorry, um... What was that? What was... Okay, first of all, that was a one-shot. Second of all... Was that a spell, or... Like, she just... I don't fucking know, man. You're not gonna hit. You're not gonna touch me. You're not gonna touch me. You're not gonna touch me. What was that? Okay. It's down. Okay, let's try that again, and... Hopefully not get absolutely wrecked by the sorceresses. You know what, if I stay here, maybe I'll have better luck avoiding these things. No, I didn't. <laughs> okay. So we really need to rethink our strategy here. God damn. We are two bosses left. On the DLC. Really need to... To start getting things done and... Being a little bit more serious about this. Because... Because, oh damn, dudes. I am not getting lucky. Dark Souls today is going... is trying to punish me. Okay. It's going to try to punish me for my hubris. That's... That's a fact. <laughs> okay, so let's continue. Let's... I think I had better luck with just... Step in here. And I just get hit by one, apparently. Yeah, one one spell. Half my health. Look at you. Oh, awful, awful things. Uh, call. This. Okay. Now, let's get the caster. Why is she... Why are they so close to me? I don't like this. Okay, I, thought that, I think that was the thing that actually got me killed last time, so... Good god that we were able to avoid it. Now, let's go into... This stupid thing. And the, the worst part, this is a unique, a unique enemy and all that, and he doesn't have anything unique to drop, doesn't have anything important. It feels like filler. Like a filler enemy. Okay, careful with that one. That's kind of bullshit. And he has a combo for that one. It's gonna spike me. Yeah. Oh, and we actually don't... We actually bounce back. If we try to, to hit him, him with a melee. Look at this. Okay. Not, not like that. You see, we bounce back and we do we don't do really much damage at all. I, I'm trying to be cautious because I know he can do my entire health bar with one hit. Look at that. Look at that shit. Ugh, damn. I think I'm going into buff for, for this. For that almost got me killed. I, mean, I think I'm going to buff up. Because, like, physical damage is doing nothing to this thing. Yeah, that's much. That's much better. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. You are you are not playing nice, so please. Let me go heal. Let me go heal. And then I can kick your ass. Where are you? Right here. Can I focus on him, please? Yeah. Closed. Motherfucker. No. No, 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 no. I won't let you do that. You see, it gives me like a piece of armor that is absolutely worthless. 
But with this, we are look at look how the um, the corruption thing is getting like progressively worse. We're going into the I don't know this is where they try to jump scare you. Yeah, this is the one that they try to jump scare you. <laughs> Fuck off. <laughs> Look at this. It's getting darker and darker. I don't think there's anything in the cells. Okay, let's go. Now I'm going to use one more humanity. Actually, I'm going to use twin humanities for this one. So I'm going to reverse the Halloween. And then I'm going to kindle the bonfire. Because the next fight is going to be real hard let's kindle it two more times that way we have at least 15 15 estes kindle it again okay now, I don't know how our, how hard this is going to be really got no idea but we are now at the bottom of the abyss. We're at the origi origin of the corruption. The chasm of the abyss, sorry, sorry. Look at that, look at that. That looks so sick. By like the way, their, their, their heads are shining in the, in the darkness. Oh, cool. But of course, I don't really... I'm not really interested in fighting these guys. At this point, uh, we have shown that we can kill them. And that's like a secret thing that you can... Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna show it because I... I already fall into it, so whatever. But this is Alvita, the cat of the forest. And she's guiding us... Through the chasm to find... You know what? Let me, let me show you. Just let me show you. And Kuro, you're, you are probably going to enjoy this... Is it here, though? Yeah, it's here. It's just trying to guide us to find Seth. I mentioned that um, she was guarding the tomb of the legendary warrior. Well, pretty much the legendary warrior was notorious and... Okay, I... If these things touch you, they will kill you. But we need to kill them to free Seth. As you can see her, like, in her normal... Big wolf with the sword of the, of her master. Again, really touching stuff if you if you know the lore. But look at that! If I touch them, they they deal damage to me. I need to be extra careful around these things. And they also drop they drop humanity, so it's either a healing item or things to kindle the bonfires with. And these are like big humanities, like. You I need to kill you because you are the most annoying one. Because I can't see you very well. Okay, I need to heal. I need to heal real quick. They try to pursue you. Try to, to circle around you and get you. You. Okay, they should be dying one hit each. Let's go ahead and do this. Okay, we're at Whiffin. Thank you. Now that we clear this, she should be. Yeah, she's gay. she's free. And she also gave us the shield of Artorias. As when he came here, the the this next box break, broke his arm and he no longer used the shield, so he gave her he gave the shield to her to Seth, to his dog. To her dog, sorry, to protect her for the corruption of the abyss and all that. So that's why she's alive in the future. And if you do this DLC before fighting Seth... Oh, and by the way, we have another shortcut into the... the arena. And we have a couple more characters to meet and all that. I'm gonna do that later. Let's, let's just focus on the boss. Um, that's if you... Like... Ah, I got the wrong one. I got the wrong one. Okay, let's go back up. Back down, please. If you do the DLC before fighting Seth, she will 
actually recognize you. And she's going to have like a different animation when you, when you go fight her for to continue with the story. So he makes a, a really sad... Like a really sad fight, even worse. Because now you know where they are, where you are. You will both know where they're, where you're there, and like she recognizes you as the person to to help her. Now, in here we should be continuing into the boss, into the boss arena. But I'm just trying to avoid the humanities. Or isn't it, isn't it here? Is it over here then? No, no, this is another item. Well, let's get it, just for the fuck of it. That's the black serpent. The black flame, sorry. That's a pyromancy that also does dark, like physical damage. And stay away from me, things. I don't want to kill you. Just want to get away and get to your boss. Let's see. I need to get my bearings around this area again. I do not remember. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, 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 shit. Bitch. Double bitch. <laughs> and I got poisoned. Fantastic. Good thing that I have this thing. The purple monsters. Okay. Stupid. That was a little bit silly on my part, but that's fine. Oh, okay, now we got to the... Um, this is where we get to the, the proper fight. Round down here. Okay, cool. This should be... There shouldn't be anything else in our way. Except that is a soul item. And a big one of that. Yep, so that I wanted that. Let's just go around the humanities. And... Oof, I don't know how well I'm going to be... good doing against this boss. Let's try it. Oof. And I'm going to let the cinematic play so you can enjoy it. You don't recognize that's the same hand that took us to the DLC. And the lore of this thing is that we have a broken pendant, and this dude became such a massive monster because he, he went mad and he's looking for the pendant, and now that we have it, he brought us to the past to get the pendant back and kick our ass in the process. But this is Manus, father of the abyss. And... Oh damn. Yeah. <laughs> That's um That is supposed to be the, the the last fight on Dark Souls 1. And you can see that he sh two shots me. Like one like two hits and I'm I'm down. <laughs> but the design is so amazing. God damn, and when you get you get to, to the lore of this thing, like massive props to, to From Software for the design. I love it. I I could talk about it, but let, let's go to the to the arena so we can see it in and we can see it firsthand. And ha. Well, firsthand is a joke because it's called Manus, so yeah. <laughs> Stupid thing to say, sorry. Now let's 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 see. Okay, we have to go here, but we need to be careful with this bitch that's going to start casting spells at us. Like that. <laughs> Okay, I, I I'm should be getting out of the of her range, right? Just holy, good thing that these things drop humanity, so we can just cure using that one. Okay, better. Let's go. So I don't really know how bad this is going to be because although he too shot me, we need to see how much damage do we do we do to this dude? Let's see. I'm gonna skip the cinematic because we have already, we already saw it. Oh damn. 
Oh, that's a combo. That's a... No, that's a... Massive hit. Like, this guy has a true combo. Right there. Like, when he gets insane... He starts, like, thrashing around, thrashing around, thrashing around, and... It's, if you get caught by that... You're pretty much screwed, unless you have good health... Or good armor. And we have neither of them, so yeah. <laughs> We're gonna be here for a while. I can sense that already. But hey. Um... Oh, everything from my audience, right? And we are actually really far into the game. I I didn't thought it possible that I was going to be able to fight every boss with the Kestus. I thought that the range and the damage just wasn't going to cut it, but so far it's been nice. It's been really cool. Oh, now I need to be careful here. Because that bitch is going to continue launching spells and I fall. And I fell. Oh, damn it. Okay. I need to enter concentration mode now because we are not going to be stuck on this boss forever. And that is a promise. Okay. Still love the, the glowing eyes there. I wouldn't mess with that, of course, but I love how it looks. And I know that I have one dude behind me, right? Yep. That's wrong. That's the only thing bad about this is the run to the to the arena is so long. Let's see if I can just get past this thing without getting shot in the back. Okay, I thought I heard that coming, so maybe we can just use that. Should be coming inside here. Yeah. But I don't think I'm going to even try to buff up until I. Oh, by the way, you can see him there in the darkness. And I've seen people that, and I did it once because I wanted to try if it was if it was possible. You can either you can also sit here with a bow with a bonus arrow and a ring that increases the range of your arrows. And snipe him from here with just arrows. It is a labor of law because it takes forever to do so. But it is possible, so... C -c cool thing, right? <laughs> okay, Mattis, so please don't kick my ass. Okay, we're going better. We're doing mm, really small damage. Okay, that's uh, the f big fuck off attack. And you see that we're pretty much, if we get caught there, we are fucked. Oh, man. This is gonna take a while. So if you haven't, go... Go get some snacks, get, get comfy, get some... I don't know, I will say either coffee or hot chocolate. Either I I want I was thinking I'm thinking right now. What would be the most like comfort comforting thing to drink? Because I know people drink coffee for different reasons. Coffee is of course the the blood of many people. But I mean if I want to feel reassured, if I want to be comfy, if I want to feel nice and nice and all that. I don't know, I will think that I will be drinking, like, like, cocoa instead of... What the... Okay. <laughs> what is that sound? Instead of coffee. What do you guys think? Would you prefer... If you want to feel comfortable, if you want to feel nice, if you want to, I don't know, snuggle in your room, it's a rainy day, and you want to maybe watch some movies, maybe relax for a little bit. What would be best? Coffee or chocolate? I know, I think I know the, 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 the answer for at least my wife. My wife will probably choose coffee. But I want to hear everyone's opinion about it. Hi, Manis. How did that hit me?
God damn it. I got fucked. And I'm whiffing my attacks too, so yeah. God damn it, man. Coffee? Yeah, I knew it. Like, Nat will be, of course, choosing coffee every single day if you could. And hey, I don't, I don't blame her. I don't blame her at all. <laughs> I don't know, I, I think for me, we'll, I will have to go for chocolate, for hot cocoa and all that. I don't know, if you want to feel... Like, if you want to warm yourself and you want to feel nice, coffee will do that for you, of course. But coffee also will make you, like, anxious. Like, will also, like, like get ca caffeine of you, of course. And, I don't know, for me, coffee, like, it activates me, like, it, it, like, wakes me up. So, it really isn't the thing for me if I want to feel, like, cuddly and, and, all, and, and all happy feelings. Okay, no, that's uh, the fox spell, so yeah. Mocha, so... Okay, so your, so your answer is mixing both of them. It's not a bad answer, I'm not gonna lie. But still, I got the same problem. It has a little bit of coffee, so it's going to wake me up. And I don't want to wake up, I just want to... to feel comfortable. You know what? And crew, talking about... I think coffee does not have the same effect on me. Maybe that's why I like it so much. So do you not feel that coffee wakes you up like like alert that like makes you more alert of things i think I, I think it does for at least for me it does so uh yeah i d d for sure has caffeine on it i don't mother fucker gonna I'm gonna run away. I'm gonna heal up. And I forgot where he was. Okay, he was here. Not all the time. Um, I don't know. I really feel that coffee isn't the best for trying to be chill about. But I, I understand what you're saying. Like, coffee doesn't have the same effect on anyone. Man, look at the volleyball juggle that he's playing with me. Oh, damn it. Can I heal, or...? Will you let me heal? No, he won't. He won't let me heal. Oh, boy. Okay, let's heal up again. Thank you. I love like he acts like a monkey. Like an actual monkey. He's so cool. Oh, for fuck's sake, come on! Uh. <laughs> yeah, like, for sure, like, 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 tea has caffeine, coffee has caffeine. So if you want to escape caffeine, you need to, you need to join the, the hot cocoa squad. That's for sure. And I'll, I was going to ask, ask you guys, because now that we're talking about tea, coffee, chocolate, mocha and all that, have you ever tried... I, I saw this in a video, and I tried it myself, and I I think it's kind of good. That you get, like, a bowl of chocolate ice cream, the best one you can find. You get it in a cup, and you pour your coffee on top of it, and then you drink it. At first, I thought it was going to be a little weird. Because you'll have, like, like a lukewarm coffee, hot ice cream... Gonna be, it was going to be weird, but after I tried it, I don't know. It's, I think it's a good combination. I think it's, it's like some sort of, of Italian thing or something. Not really a hundred percent sure about that, but apparently it is. Like I don't know. I don't remember the name. Um, maybe Nat. Do you remember the, the name of that that thing? But yeah, it's pretty much. Uh, you take a bowl of a uh, bowl of chocolate ice cream, put it in your cup, and you pour your coffee on it. Man, it tastes amazing. It tastes so good. 
Okay, let's try one more time to kill this asshole. So my problem is that if I want to hit him, I need to be close. And if I'm close, he's gonna throw the tantrum. But that is my issue. Motherfucker. Are you gonna let me recover at least? You <laughs> Man, like, I take one hit and I'm down for the counts. Oof. Boy. It's gonna take a while. You know what? I love my Hornet ring. I'm sorry, my... My wolf ring and my dark wood green, but I am really trying. I'm really trying to get this done, so I'm going to have to default to the Havel strategy. Ah, uh, it's not really nice. I know what I don't want to be here. Let's see if a little bit more protection will actually help me. How much do they have? Twenty six. Yeah, that's. I think that's the best I can do. Let's see. That ain't Af Afogato, yeah, that's the, that's the name of it. Man, so good, so fucking good. All right, and you know what? Can we, uh, like, love, can, can we order some ice cream and have some for today? I think I'm going, to I'm going to be deserving a treat today. If we actually get our plans working and we defeat the boss. <laughs> that is Drown in Italian. Okay. Well, it, it makes sense, right? Like, you're dr you're you're literally drowning the, and, and I, I f why I feel that they do more damage now. Okay, you're actually drowning the 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 ice cream in in coffee, so like, it makes sense. <laughs> it makes sense to call it like that. Okay, so I'm going to try to buff now. Now that I see that our damage is. It really could be. It really, could, we could use an improvement there, but we won't. Let's. One hundred and sixty. Okay. Closed. Now I fucked up. Or maybe not. Too slow. That one I can heal. Too early. Too early for that dodge. Cool. And he's probably... No, he didn't throw the tantrum there. It's a big hand. Tantrum? Yeah! Okay, so now that's how we avoid this bullshit. Cool. Okay, we're we're doing we're doing fine. Oh boy. Okay. Okay, he started to get mad and adding some new attacks to their to his bullshit. And I fucked that up real bad. And I run away for a bit of it. That was close. Too early. I need to be I need to try to stay calm. Really tr need to try at least. Okay, that wasn't so bad. That is the worst possible moment. Oh shit. Okay, I need to run the fuck away. And heal up. Oh, damn. Okay, he's right next to me. Heal. 
Okay, thank you, dude. Okay. Let me run, please. Just let me... Ah, oh, shit. Okay. Heal. Mother fucking Christ. Too early. But that's where the pendant is for. And I was too late. Julio. Now I, I too early. I chicken out. Don't kill my cousin. That's my Hey, Accent, I'm sorry, but I have to kill him. I know that he's your long lost cousin because you are also called Manus. Come on, dude. Like, do you want to finish Dark Souls or not? <laughs> we have to make some sacrifices, right? And Rocky Balboa has made the biggest sacrifice of all time by consistently getting slapped by your, by your cousin for... What, like, half an hour, maybe? <laughs> so, like, let Rocky has his revenge, dude. Come on. I know Mattis might be not, uh, like, a, like, a total douche, but... Like, he's not letting, letting us progress. Uh, we're trying to be peaceful, but he isn't... He isn't helping us. I can try to talk? Have you seen how he treats me? <laughs> Uh, he ragdolls me around, volleyballs me, and then he slaps me to death. I, I think we are past conversations at this point. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, let's go. To send, I am very, very sorry for you, but we need to do this. You see that? He slapped me. Oh, fuck me. That's why trying to get in gets me. Let me heal. Thank ya. Awesome. Okay. So I think that we now know how to deal with that attack. But a volleyball slam, that's a different thing. Okay. Going to hit him in the knee as much times as, as I can. Oh, crap. Crap. Ah, damn it. Ah, damn, bro. I hate you, Manus. <laughs> Oof, okay. I could have healed on that attack. Okay, but we can use this one then. Dude, how can we evade that shit? Oof, so 50-50. Okay. How many attacks are you gonna do at the se in sequence? Heal, please. Thank you. 
You're gonna probably going to start to use your stupid magic now. I I dodged that. And I'm I'm fucked. I am absolutely fucked. Ah, damn. Talking with fist. It works. Hey, you know what? It works. <laughs> it's because he's hungry. Uh, not my fault, man. And I, I'm I'm sorry, but I I don't have anything to eat with me, so uh, we are going to have to talk with your fist. I'm sorry. Have you learned from anime that you can speak with your fist? That's it. That absolutely is. Hey, double A project. Thank you for following. Thank you for following, man. Hope you are enjoying it. If you're still here, because I don't know. <laughs> okay, let's. I don't know, man. I. I think we did better, but we are still taking so much damage that it's almost impossible for us to make a mistake. And we're doing. We're making plenty of mistakes, man. Maybe a coffee could work? <laughs> Man. Should I give him a coffee? You know what, Let, let's offer something to him, right? To see if he, if he gets... A little bit less... Less pissy about it. Let's see. Ouch. Like, the, the worst part about getting hit by the witches is that after they cast the super spell, they laugh at you. And you're like, go fuck yourself. Okay, let's get this on. Okay. What should we offer? What do we have? What do we have that he might be interested in? Let's give him rubbish. You know what? Let's give him rubbish and see if that appeases your, your cousin. Hey, I got your rubbish, so please don't kill me. No, it didn't work. You see, that's the rubbish right there, and sh it's not taking it. No, it's not taking it. He doesn't like rubbish. Can I heal? Okay, I'll he's letting me heal, but that's progress. We might be able to, to work something out. Ooh, we can punish the the long fist. So maybe mid range is better for us. Maybe not. <laughs> okay, it works. Keeps working for me, so if you want to keep doing that, fine by me. Hey, here's the rubbish. Take it, take it, take it, and we can be friends. You have your hand right there. Take it. No, he doesn't want it. You can fault me for trying, though. Ouch. I'm sorry, how many attacks are you going to make? I'm out of stamina because I'm dodging every single thing that he throws at me. Okay. I with that. Oh shit. Mother fucking bullshit thing. Okay, let's heal up. He's gonna punch me right in the face. Can we can we chill? Can we chill for a moment? Now we can't. Okay. Manus, please, let's let's chill. Hear me out, hear me out. I know your cousin. <laughs> I know your cousin. We can we can be friends. 
Ah, man. You haven't had enough patience to pass Dark Souls. Hey, um... I can see why. <laughs> now that I'm doing this challenge, I can see why. But hey, it is... It is not a bad game, dude. Uh, you should be... You should... Give it a try someday. Uh, get your... Get a little sketch on the calendar. Get some coffee. <laughs> Apparently coffee is better for, for patience. And enjoy it. Just focus on enjoying the game. And don't do a fist only challenge run. Because you are not gonna enjoy this on your first thing on this game. It is absolutely hard. And I'm talking from experience because I have been mother fucking Ah <laughs> Give coffee to my honest cousin. Uh do you want some coffee scent? I mean I don't have coffee myself. That's the, that's the sub part, right? But we can we, we can we, we can we can order a coffee or something. <laughs> You already have? Oh, okay. So in that case, I envy you a lot. <laughs> so I, I, I want my coffee with, with ice cream. Now now I now I have that, like... My brain is gonna ask me to, to give her, to give a coffee and, and ice cream at the same time. And it's going to boycott the game. He's gonna say, like, hey, if you, get, if you don't get that, then you're not gonna be doing anything else. Yeah, don't do it there, play it. Why not? Why not? Oh fuck. I got distracted. <laughs> Stop laughing at me, stupid thing. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I think the Dark Souls is an experience that you you really have to to play for yourself and see if you like it or not. For me, it's been one of my favorite games of all time. I know people that has bounced back of this game hard because of the difficulty. So it's a mix, and the best way to know if you like something or not is to just try it out. Well, DM, tell me, um, have you had any... Uh, have you tried Dark Souls? Have you... Why didn't you recommend it? Because so far, I think it's a, it's a good game. It has its problems, of course. I mean, we had a whole video yesterday. We have like an, an hour talking about how I hate Lost Isolate as a, as a complete zone. Okay, at least I didn't I didn't fall there. <laughs> God damn. Okay, let's get here. Thank you. Let's heal. Let's try one more time. Man, I don't know what's happening. Well, I, I understand what's happening, of course. It's for people who want to suffer a little. Mm, yeah, I'll, I'll say it. I'll, 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 I think I'll agree with that with uh, take. If you want to like get stressed in with a game and actually like feel like challenge and get beaten over and over again, as an example, you can see it right here with this boss. If you don't want that on on, on your game on your game session, it is not the game for you. Um, if you are However, looking for a like a, a challenge to overcome and you are that type of, of gamer that like gets like he like likes yeah like like you're saying like hits hits the head against the wall for hours on end to get something done, then this game could be for you. For sure. Okay, we're starting with the combos already. Holy shit. Manus, please! So maybe leaving the rubbish was actually we were on to something because he's starting right right away with kicking our ass. You're gonna I can never predict the staff attack. Holy shit. And the hand going backwards is weird to to picture. Okay, let's try. Let's do it. Of course. Of course. 
Tantrum? No. Okay, but that's an opportunity to heal right there. Awesome. Tantrum. Really? The problem is the range, dude. If I were able to hit from a little longer, we, sh we could take more opportunities. Damn. Okay. That's a heal. Tantrum, fuck me. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm so conscious about that attack that now I fear it the most. If he gets us with another one, we're gonna get fucked. I whiffed that attack. I. 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 Mm. The full combo. Fuck. Me. Oof. Okay, minus. What now? What now? I hate that volleyball move. I really do. Let's get out. Let's get away. Damn it. I'm going to get. Oh no! I actually didn't get wrecked by that thing. Okay, what now? Tantrum, again. Thank you. Thank you for that. That was too close for my liking. Damn it. Okay, we need to be careful now. Fucking hell, dude. Okay, we have the tiny on that one. Pretty well marked down. Ah, shit. Okay, Manus. We are halfway there. So please try to help us a little. We're doing a challenge, okay? So if you can cooperate, we can make this easier for everyone. No, backhand. Backhand. God damn it. Got safe there. What was that? I'm sorry, what? We're getting places now. And immediately after I said that, we got the tantrum. Here we have buffed up a little. Again. Oh! Boy. <laughs> that was nice. Skill up. Damn it. Oh, man. We were close on that one. We were really close on that one. Like two thirds of the way. Fuck, man. Fuck it, I'm gonna go get 20 Estus. I think I'm gonna need it all. And Kuro again, um... <laughs> props to to the dude that actually did this hitless. God damn. Like, I can almost not... I can't believe it. Fuck me. This has been, of course, uh, an experience. For those who don't know, this is my, my first time doing any kind of challenge for Dark Souls. I was absolutely rusted at the beginning because I 
haven't touched this game for years. And then, of course, we have the thing that what we're trying to do here, for, for, for those who need a reminder, is that we're trying to play or finish Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3, like all the three games, with fist only, like, so just punching our way through it. That's the name of the title. And this is just... Or we have a time constraint that is... Having done this just before, hopefully before, the DLC for Elden Ring arrives. And when we have the DLC, we're going to go play Elden Ring. Hope, and we're going to try to be to build a fist weapon only challenge there as well. We're going to have the full Souls trilogy with this, with this format. And hopefully it's going to be a way for me to get better at the game. And of course to, to share my love for this thing with everyone here. That's of the Frazzle. For that spiel. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Okay. <sighs> Let's focus, man. No hit sometime. Dude, when I can... Ha when I feel comfortable enough to do a no hit, I'm going to try it. But let's be real, it's gonna take me forever, man. <laughs> so this if it's only we are we are doing some of a good damage and we are getting our asses kicked. So I don't know how well I can play for a no hit. I'll try it, I'll try it at some point. Maybe after we finish the other plans for, for the series, but oh man. <laughs> I don't feel that I'm good enough to play no no hit. As explained on that exact moment. We have been hit three times, four times, and we haven't done a single point of damage to the boss. God damn. Okay, Manus, relax for a moment. Let me heal up. Thank you, Manus. Punch him, punch him, punch him. Careful with the tantrum. Bro fist. <laughs> yeah, we need to we actually need to take more advantages like the long arm attack. Because we are relatively safe. And we can do a little bit of damage there. It's like a free damage. Oh, damn it. I'm sorry, let me read that real quick. Spell dress, spend them twice and then roll bad spelling. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. I'm gonna try to read your message after. I mean, just get an opportunity to get out of way from him. This should be enough. Spell dress, spend them twice and roll left. But that's for what? For the shower or? Some, some about the shower is it isn't the best the worst part about this it's actually the um, oh hi Sif we can summon her for this fight but I don't want to I want to be doing this solo I thought that I dodged that okay heal up again oh dazzle uh, let me know let me know because I, I didn't I didn't get that that one you're, you are referring about the, the shower, right? To avoid the shower... The Dark Orb. Ah, got close. What I was thinking. Go here. Okay, I really thought that I had avoid. Okay, he's just... Jumping at me. Do that. Focus, man. Focus. Focus. Should I... Let's see. Too early. Too early. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. That's my way to heal up. Yeah, the shower. I'll try it, I'll try it for sure. So two times and roll to the left. I'm gonna give it a try if we get to that phase. Because right now we're sucking more than usual. 
Okay. <laughs> Ah, oh, god damn, man. This man is kicking my ass. Absolutely kicking my ass. And we still have, what, like three more bosses to go? We have Kelamit, we have Windolin, and the final one is, um, Win. Like, just, we just need to fit, beat Win and we, we should have all the bosses. Man, just three more. And I feel that we can do it. I just need to get better at dodging Manus' attacks. And Calamite, I I know that he hits really, really hard, but I don't believe that their his attacks are like too difficult to avoid. Or at least I don't remember. I don't remember the attacks to be that difficult. We'll have to see. We'll have to see. Still have depend on there, just making sure. I think I'm going I'm going to go crazy fighting this man. I'm missing the 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 thing the, the guys that shoot him from arrow, arrow from here and kill them. Okay, so let's go back. Oh man. <laughs> Our I don't I don't want to do this, but if we if we take still too long to beat this guy, I will I will try to do it with like full havels and tank through it. I don't think that's possible. Still, we did it. We tried to do it with Artorias, and I didn't. It didn't feel well nice to play to. So. Okay, the second. I think the second dodge has to be precise. If, if it isn't, then you can't do anything about it. Okay. That's good. That's a way to heal. Cool. Okay. Sorry if, if I'm too quiet, I'm just trying to concentrate a little bit. Okay, he has. Thank you, man. Thank you, Kuro. I'll try. <laughs> I'll try for sure. There was a couple of hits there. A couple more hits to the hand. Damn it. Close. Tantrum? No. Uppercut. Okay, that was nice. And I whiffed that attack immediately. Oh shit. I wanna get okay, I didn't got caught on that. Let me heal real quick. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, come on! Five attacks in a row! What are you gonna do now? I can whiff that real quick. Let's heal up. Okay. Need to not be greedy attacking the, the arms. Okay. We're slowly getting there. Real slowly. Okay, okay. We're doing it, we're doing it. It's going to probably use... Start using attacks soon. The magic attack, sorry. It's been attacking the whole time, right? <laughs> okay, it's fine there. Tantrum again. I'm gonna take the opportunity to heal because I don't want it to to get one shot in case we miss something. Like that, for example. Damn it. Okay. I tend to forget that the, the arena is kinda big. Oh, 
of course I missed the opportunity there. And I always think that I'm going to fall for some reason. But now I remember that it is impossible to fall because we have a magic circle around. And I mess that up again. Okay. Kill up there. Ah, oh, come on! Do something. Besides that, anything but that, come on. One hit, slow and steady. Hey dude, that was... Okay, that's helpful, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for that. Oh, it looks like with one... With just one is enough to... To repel that. Okay, I used it early. Damn. Okay, I'm just spamming it at, at this point. <laughs> hey, Dazzle, that, that was a good... Yeah, that's... That's a really good... Um, tip, man. Thank you for that. Because, yeah, I, it is kind of silly that the... Um, the orbs stay there just to hit you once the spell ends. <laughs> Okay, what now? Okay, it was too... Alright, I fucked it up. <laughs> oh wait, I'm alive! What? <laughs> How? Okay, Manus. Give me your best shot. Not that one. But thank you. Man, the, the staff attack uh, gets so fast. Spell? No, hand. Ooh, we're almost at the edge. Careful there. Okay, Manus, what now? Cool. Okay, 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 okay. Okay, we missed the second one. Fuck! <laughs> okay, I, I was stupid on that part. That was stupid. Let's get healed. Get the pendant ready. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Okay, it still works. I feel we should probably buff up. I'm going to try and get a an opening to to heal to buff. When I heal there, when I buff there, ah, oh, come on! Damn it! Oh, I got volleyballed. Fuck me! Need to time it presses better. And of course I get destroyed. Just as I'm about to get. Go up. Okay, dude. Oof. Okay, so are we spamming this to that or what? Or are we doing something? Damn. Damn, 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 damn. Okay. Just do your stupid jump. Okay. Careful, careful, careful. Heal. Okay, do another one, please. Oh, crap. Oh, okay. <laughs> man, that, that. That tip was amazing, man. Dazzle. 
Thank you. <laughs> okay, we are... Ah, damn. Heal, 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 heal. Double heal, I don't care. What now? Okay, that's fine. I don't want you to just hit me. Come on, Minus, I know you want to hit me. Okay, now I know the difference. Oh, but that slap. Don't, don't slap me again. Damn it. Minus, please help. Okay, now we are stuck. This is the final showdown. And I, I got a stupid volleyball. Okay, while you finish playing up with me, let's get some humanities. We are so close that I build... God... Damn it. Ah, oh, man. Okay. But we're making incredible progress. Like... Incredible. incredible. I mean, we were... We were dominating that fight for the most part until I started making like input mistakes. Damn. So we're we are going we're getting somewhere. And uh, now I understand where the difference between the shadow thing, the the shower thing, and the the shotgun. Because the shotgun he likes he gets the stuff like near him and then he releases it and that's the, the stupid thing. Or at least that's what I saw. Let's see. Let's put that to the test now. Oh, man, we're, we're, we're doing we're, we're doing it, man. And I don't think we have to rely on Havel's bullshit. Let me hear for the spell. She didn't guess that? Hey, fi by, fine by me. Yeah, okay. So I'm getting a little bit concerned about the... The... Um, durability of the, of the Gestas. I'll need to check that... After this try, I don't think we are, like, about to get cooked, but which is probably going to be... We're going to be, be have to repair it soon. Okay, so Manus, come on. Come on, bro. Let's do this. Here. One hit there. That slap also terrifies me. That god was killed last time. How many times are you gonna use that? Right in the hand. Right in the hand again. Careful, slap. Ah, damn. He delays that so much. Okay, what now? Punch him. Cool. What else? What else did you have? Come on, Manus, come on. Brofist. Brofist. <laughs> come on, Manus. Slap. Uppercut. I don't know, I'm starting an NPC doing weird noises. Why are you starting to memorize the attacks? Sweep. Jump. Okay. Mm. Okay, I need to heal now. I'll do something, please. Slap. Cool. You can heal. Another slap. Fine. What else? What else do you have for me? What about spike? Okay. You know what? Let's let's waste this right away. Those hits didn't connect for some reason. 
uppercut. Okay, nice. Three hundred damage. We're doing good. Against two hundred twenty-six. Hey, yeah, it's better to use use the cool there. Oh, damn it. Flap there. Under 90. Uh, careful with the tantrum. Cool. Yeah, that's... Okay, we avoided that. Nearly. <laughs> Do your hand thing. Awesome. It works better. Or at least I feel like it works better to just hit the light attacks instead of the heavy ones. Yeah, we're doing progress, man. This one is gonna be heavy because I don't think I have enough opportunity. Um, are we close to a... Okay, that's a Trantrum. That's fine. I would get cocky and buff with power within, but I don't feel it. Awesome. That was awesome, dude. Okay, 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 jump. Fine. Slap him in the hand. Staff. Hand. S staff. Hand. Damn it. Hand again. That was close. What now, Manus? What are you gonna do to me now? Okay, so we deflected that. We... I don't know how we didn't die with that one. Uh, that was a little... sad for my part, but okay. Cool. Damn it! Okay, we need to heal. Heal, 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 heal. Okay, what now? Hand. Cool. Uh, not not so cool anymore. But where do we, where where? If I don't get stupid, we might be able to do this this right. If I don't, if I don't fucked up. Let's go. Oh shit. Bitch slap me. Oh, the humanities are actually... I actually... <gasps> no, they are they are not gonna kill me. They are actually going to save my fucking life. I need to be careful which thing I have selected. Tantrum. I'm gonna take the chance to get max... Max HP just in case. And mm. a little bit bullshit there, but that's fine. Oh no, shower, 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 shower. No. Okay, we survived that. Need to be careful with what I have to select though. I'm still being anything else? Okay. Okay, chat, chat, chat. Okay, pay attention. We might be able to do this. We might be able to defeat this guy. So... Oh, man. So please, don't make me fuck up. Give me your power. Oh, damn it. Ah, oh, goddamn humanities! Actually, getting me killed. I'm gonna take that out of the bar. I am. Um, I don't have the mental capacity to <laughs> to get that in my to get the the humanities 
and dependent at the same time, so I... Fuck, that was so close, man. Like, couple hits, and he was down. Ugh. Okay. But we know that we can do it. We have now seen pretty much all the attacks. We have adapted our dodge to it. I know, Nat, I know. Ugh, we were so close, like... Like I say, like, like two, three more hits and he was down. Down for the count, for sure. That was the one, yeah. Yeah, that was the one. And figures, it, it, we didn't have to give him coffee for it. I hit after the tantrum. I know I, I, it's it's possible if I run to it and wait, what, right after he gets the 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 hand and the staff together and slams them to, to the ground. What it worries me to do and to do so is that after that, if he gets me with a hopper kit, like he finished that and this does the the hand racing thing, we're gonna be in serious trouble. But I'm going to try it. I'm going to try it out. See it here. Okay. Oh, hand. It's fine. Staff. That uppercut. That's the one that I'm... I... Like, he can... Access to it so quickly that I'm afraid that if I go for the uppercut, for the tantrum, I'm gonna get hit by that. But let's see, let's see. I want, I want to try it out. That's what you have been giving me is good advice, so I'm going to at least try. Okay. And now that I know that the... The light attacks are a little bit better against him. We might be able to to do some good things here. Let's get him out of the the backhand. Okay. Cool. 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 And. Try our, let's try our theory here if he throws a tantrum there. Ah, we don't we don't we don't I don't think we can do that. Let's see. Slap. Come on, come on, come on. Uppercut. Fine there. Tantrum, okay. Let's see. Now be careful once as he finish ups. Okay. Okay, we can. But that's the thing. He recovered from that one so fast that depending on the attack is kinda scary. I just wanna take one hit. To not get greedy. But yeah, we can speed up the process with that uh, that attack after the tantrum. Okay. I get hit once. Yeah, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna heal. No taking any chances here. Damn it. Stupid stone almost got me killed. Thank you, Manus. Okay, a couple hits in. Yeah, that was. That was a one shot! Ah! <laughs> Okay, but your theory was, was right, asshole. We we can go in after the tantrum and get one or two hits, um, but we need to be prepared to dodge. Like we need we absolutely need to be prepared to dodge that one. We're close, man. We're so close. Oof. Okay. <laughs> but I'm so close that I, I I'm actually feeling nervous. Right, right. Like my hands probably are shaking. I damn it. <laughs> And again, uh, for what we were talking about, the, the uh, I don't know, people liking difficult, difficult games. I'm gonna hide here for a sec, because I don't want you to kick my ass. Okay, now, you choose the mist, so we can just run. Uh, this is the things that, of course, no, not all people are going to like it. But the race, the racing sensation of... Being so close to defeat a boss is 
and well, this is this is a sensation. The, the, the souls like capture, I think, the best in, in, of any game. That's the thing that you feel nervous. You feel you feel your heart your heart pumping. Your mind like completely focusing on the fact of the attacks of the enemy and doing like the little dance to avoid an attack and avoid an attack. That's the beauty of these kind of games. And I know the difficulty isn't for everyone. I know that people will perhaps call this to be masochistic, to try to have a game actually punish you. <laughs> but hey, it's something to enjoy. There is something to enjoy here. If, if, it, if it wasn't, I don't know. I don't think that Dark Souls would be such a renowned name in gaming. Ah, that was too early. Okay, so I'm gonna try to not... Slap. Heal. Two hits there. Not, in, not getting greedy. I can guess I'm, I get like a maximum of two hits. Okay. Okay, that's a, that's a nasty combo right there. Damn it! Oh. <laughs> Oof. Oh damn! <laughs> That's I don't know. It's it's a it's. I, I I at the risk of sounding cheesy and kind of stupid at the same time. You enter in like a flow state, and I am I think I'm getting that term and. From Mirror's Edge, but that's but it is true in this in this kind of game. Like you just start feeling and predicting and like narrowing reacting to to the enemy, to the surroundings, and all that. And it's like a feeling that not many games can capture, or not as well as uh, this type of games, at least. Okay, now I'm gonna. Have... Oh, you know what? Okay, get your kill. Stay away from the humanities and continue. I had to have bang uh, to revenge, revenge on that sorcerer because she has hit me so many times. I had to kill it at least once. <laughs> and yeah, I think that's the beauty of games. Again, and I, I I know I have been saying that for the last two or three streams, but games have something very very special about them. The way you can interact with the story, to overcome challenges and all that. It's something that nothing else can give you. Okay, three hits there was fine. Uppercut there. But now... I prefer if you give me the hand, bro. That's better. Four hits is an entire bar. No, oh, damn it. And again. I'm gonna just run past everything, heal up real quick. Two hits. Tantrum, okay. Just test the theory. One hit there because I'm scared. But we can actually take advantage of the Trantrum now. And I have my wall my back against the wall, so I'm going to be careful there. Another tantrum, fine. Cheeky hit. Grab. And Okay. Oof. That is a lot of damage. Heal. Thank you for that jump. Mm, that's the another. That's a different kind of jump that I don't like. Okay. One hit. Run a little hit there. Oh manus. Let me a solid. Okay. Tantrum again. Cool. Okay, what now? Uppercut. Nice. 
Look at it again. Gonna be careful because he's going to probably start using magic. And Brofist. Tantrum again. Cool. Okay, so I can start doing like, like a heavy hit when he enters the tantrum. I tried to use it and I fucked up and I'm sorry. Let's heal. The shotgun is horrible, man. Again, careful with the pendant. Careful there. Ah, try to use it a little bit sooner. Kinda worked. That's a shower thing. Careful with manas. Ah, you motherfucker. Okay, but I can still I can. I just heal. Just heal through it. Fine, fine, fine. We are halfway there. And in mid-range, we can actually avoid it as normal. We don't need the pendant for it. But we ha that's This is the best distance to have, I guess, manas, I guess. Ugh. Too early of a dodge. Tantrum. And I'm gonna get hit. Oh, no. I didn't. Cool. Cool heal. I couldn't take the chance for the tantrum. But that's fine. We're gonna get another chance soon. Three hits. I'm panicking. I'm acting too early. Ah, sip it, sip it on my part. Cool. Careful with the shower. Okay, so, damn it! I really thought that I used the pendant. Like at the moment I, I see the balls, but I, I have I think I have to protect the God damn. Okay, so guys, give me just one second. I'm just going to take a quick break, like two minutes max. I'm gonna get more water and I'll be right back, okay? Just give me one sec. Okay, okay, we're back. Thank you, thank you for waiting. Oh, I just needed to get some water. Can you guys hear me? Hopefully you can. Hopefully everything's fine. Hopefully nothing that what I was out of the picture, but hopefully everything's fine. <laughs> okay, so let's, oh, let's take a deep breath. Let's relax for a moment. Let's fix the mic. Kinda of weird the position that it is. And let's let's do this man, let's do this. I started to think that the problem is that I do not have I don't have I don't know. 
have the, the energy? I don't feel that tired, but maybe that's the thing. And I'm feeling like... I don't know, like... We have been playing for, what, four hours and a half. Maybe that's start, it started taking a toll. But at least, okay, let's do something. At least it's, I know that I said that I was going to, to finish this game today. If you all really want to do it, I will. Like, for sure I will. But I don't know if you guys have the time to actually watch me suffer through this thing. So, let's do something. I owe you guys like two hours of... Because of the previous stream, one of the streams got, was cut short due to issues with, with OBS. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you those two hours today. We're gonna go until 10 p.m. That's my local time, by the way. <laughs> so two hours more for anyone else that is not in my same time zone. Let's go there. Portable, portable tackle. Right now. Heal up. There. Let's see, let's see. And staff. And and uh slap. Okay. So jump early. I have I am having an issue right now and he said I don't have audio. <laughs> I don't have audio on the game for some reason. Uh just to make sure, can you all hear the game? Yeah, obvious shows that you can. But I don't know why my headphones are not picking it up. They are connected, so what's going on there? What's going on, game? You can hear the game, bitch. Yeah, yeah, it's that the running is fine. I think it's my headphones that either died on me or I don't know what happened to them. Let's turn that off and turn it on real quick. Sorry for the inconvenience, but I need to hear what's going on in the game. <laughs> So it sh should be should be fine. Let me just real quick. I really need to get this fixed. <laughs> One sec, guys. I'm going to see if uh, getting in and out of the game will fix this. Doesn't. I'm gonna quit. I'm gonna quit the game real quick. You're gonna see my beautiful mug for a moment. But I really need to get some, my sound back. Meantime, let's let's go for the just chatting screen for a sec. Hi, there you can see your beautiful names and the amazing support that you have given me for this stream. And once again, like for every single one of you that have been commenting, that have been talking during the session, that at us off with your advice, everyone here, thank you so much for. For being here for me today. Okay, let's let's do something. It's not picking up my one sec. And yeah, I mean, I just wanted to. Now that we are just fixing technical issues, I can take the time to. Really, really thank you for pretty much all your support. <laughs> because I know it's silly, I know it's a thing for a small streamer. But hey, I have we have been like what, like five guys here enjoying a game to bits. And uh that's something that I absolutely adore. And I again thank you. I want to thank you for everything. Now it seems that yeah, we have sound back. Cool. So we're going to be we're going to go back into the action. Let's go back to the in-game screen. Awesome. Sorry for that inconvenience, but let's go. And truly, for the bottom of my heart, everyone that is listening to me, that is has been watching the stream, that had followed me on the platform, and for those who are new and who don't who don't know. 
I also upload these videos to YouTube, so Twitch doesn't because Twitch normally erases them. So I just want to have this displayed for the posterity. So you can, if you want to rewatch it, it's on YouTube. If you want to see like content on YouTube as well, I have some. I have a couple videos. Nothing on Dark Souls yet, but I am thinking that I'm going to cut. I'm going to butcher the the hell out of the streams. I'm going to, I'm going to have like a highlight thing going, like to show that the, this happened and you guys were here with me. <laughs> That's the plan, at least. And if we do this today, then uh, maybe for maybe for next week we're going to have that episode, and hopefully your name is going to be on it. <laughs> hopefully, right? What else? What else? Yeah, and YouTube I have a couple games. I'm trying to co I'm going to cover like every single Souls game there. I'm going to. I'm planning. I'm waiting. I already have the game pre-order, the DLC for for Elden Ring. I have it there as well. And I'm going to play to cover it because Elden Ring was a fantastic game. And now, um, I also cover like Dead by Daylight stuff as a game that I have enjoyed. And Kuro was actually the one that introduced me to that competitive scene of Dead by Daylight. It's kind of kind of cool. Alright, now let's focus back into the game. Because we need to f mess this dude up. This dude up. Gonna go... Ah, oh, that uppercut just barely grazed me. Tantrum. Okay, let's get out of there. Let's heal up. No, we, we couldn't take the hit there, but that's fine. Staff, hand. Damn it. That jump actually is trying is getting me messed up. Cool. Okay. The manus. Another tantrum. Cool. We get out of there. We wait him to finish, we get some attacks there. Ah, we whiffed. Backs backhand. Okay, so he gave us he's giving another chance. That's the thing, right? That's what he was looking for. That stuff was real close there. Tantrum, fine. Let's go. Another hit. Awesome. Four full bars down. Five bars. Oh shit. That hit me. Yeah, that hit me. And after that little massage. Let's heal up. Cool. Ugh, nearly avoided that thing. Need to just click it once. I know your tricks, Manus. You won't defeat me. Now he's gonna kick my ass because I said that. Okay. <laughs> Took me a little. Oh, fuck off. Okay, that was close. Tantrum, and I'm gonna get hit. Yeah. Ah, oh, I need to heal right after this one. 
Damn! <laughs> we were what? Half health? Yeah, near nearly half health. Okay, so we are getting better at it. And I, I know I keep saying that we truly are getting better at that fight. Make sure here that the chat is working properly. Okay. Yeah, okay. Let's go. Oof, I think this is... Yeah, we can all agree that this has been the most difficult fight so far in the game, right? Because holy moly. I need a, I, I'm going to add a dead counter to... To the thing, right? I have to. Just to know how many times did Manus kick my ass. Bitch. Yeah, fall down, please. Or not. Your choice. And I got... Um, truck into the humanities. Spell? Right here. Yep. I heard it just where it was coming. Oof. It was close. Yeah, okay. Sorry if I'm quiet. So I'm so sorry if I'm, if I'm being quiet, but I... S it's really, at this point, it, I think it's necessary for me to focus on this dude. Okay, 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 okay. We are we're going places. We're doing some damage. We just need to keep our cool. If we keep our cool, everything should be should work. And if we don't get trapped in a stone. <laughs> That's another huge thing. Heal up. That's the best attack to punish. I hope that he did that... That slam more often. That was a 360. Okay, that has to be moved away from him. Heal up just in case. Get our free hit. Oh, that was not so free, after all. With that, I was with the last two. Okay, two hits there. I dodge for nothing. Okay, Manus, come on. Damn it, the staff thing. Tantrum, let's get out. Let's take the opportunity to heal. Our free attack. Uppercut. Okay, Manus, come on. Tantrum again, cool. I almost got in too, too, too early. Yeah, that's the one that I want. It's gonna. Oof. Close. Ah, damn. I didn't saw the arm for the slap. Yeah, roar. Roaring is fine. Oof. Okay, I thought it was that was a slap, but now it was just a an uppercut. 
Thank God. Oof. Damn. Okay, now. Now I know that if he moves the staff, I need to use the, the thing right away. No matter what it is. Okay. Uppercut, that's fine. Bam. I got clipped there. Okay, again. Shower. That was a little silly. Punish. Uppercut. Heal. Spend them for emergencies. Don't you want to... Don't you want to use a tantrum, please? Staff and hand. Cool. Slap. No, I stupidly thought about that was something else. Throwing it out. Heal up. Get out of the hands way. Come on, come on. Staff. Okay. What now, minus? Okay, tantrum. Cool. That I can work with. Shame that we didn't have the extra attack, but that's fine. Okay, now we're getting now we're getting it done. Not even the shower. Yeah, the shotgun can kill us. Okay. What else, Manus? Ooh, fist. Uppercut? Fine. Fuck yeah, man. That is some progress. Tantrum. Okay. Okay, finish up that bullshit. One extra hit. Uppercut? Oh, grab, sorry. And we can... Staff, hand, big slap there, jump, I'm gonna heal, I don't want to risk anything, man. Tantrum, fuck, I got hit, ugh. Okay, but we are alive, heal up, that is acceptable. Let's run out of there. Heal again. Get the pendant ready. Man, Dazzled, your, your advice has been fantastic, man. I owe you, I owe you this, this win, man. Okay, another tantrum, that's fine. Extra hit. Alright, if you're going to give me get hits, that's fine. Chat, end of the end of the road here. One little health bar left. And we're sucking. Okay, fine, fine, fine. We're doing we're not doing bad. Backhand, of course. Tantrum, okay. Damn it! Did it! We did it! We did it! No, one more, one more. We did it. We did it, guys! We did it! Ooh. Oh, damn, bro! Oh, praise the sun, praise fucking everything. Man, we 
fucking did it. Fuck you, Dusk. I don't care about you. <laughs> Rocky Balboa, once again, the hero of this fucking thing. Whew. Thank you, every single one of you that, did, that was here with me doing this. Oof, I couldn't... I couldn't have done it without you guys. Thank you so very much. Oh, man. <laughs> I, f I actually feel like... A, a mixture of 10 times lighter and 10 years o like older at the same time. Fucking hell. Oh. That was a good fight, man. That was an amazing fight. Loved it. I'm gonna get more help because I don't want to get one shot at again. And we're gonna warp into the Ulasil Sanctuary. No. Yeah, the Sanctuary no, Township will be the best. Let's go to the Township and get the final boss of the DLC. Because we're pumping right now, man. We're gonna kick. We're gonna kick some dragon ass. That is what we're going to do. And if we're able to do so, I'm going to introduce you to another NPC. <laughs> there are two, actually. There is, like, a... You can see her right there. She's mourning Artorias. She's, she was, like... I don't know, like, her lover... Night partner thingy. Weird shit right there. Thanks, and Thank you so much for being here as well. Hope you liked it. Hope you... You like... I hope you like... Oh, oh you like to see me suffer. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, guys. This is the giant. Is Hawk the giant? Sorry, Hawkeye God. Sorry. Yeah, I, I kill Artorias. He's just he was being he just was trapped here. He's carving things. I don't think he sells some anything particularly good. Not really. Talk about that I need to. This is the NPC that we have to talk to to defeat defeat the final boss here. Um, it is a dragon that is going to be perpetually flying and um, flying over the chasm, and the only way to actually start like the proper fight with it is through towards talking to that NPC. And you're gonna see how cool it is because. Man, he's a giant blind archer. And he fucking rules. You're gonna see it. And she's the girl, she's... I don't want to give you Soul Fortorius because that's mine. I don't wanna give you anything. Again, the body of Artor the thing that Artorius kills is still here. Now, in order to unlock this boss, we need to first go down into, like, this dried-up river. This ravine thingy. Let's go. And we need to actually s see the dragon. We saw it before, when we were crossing through the bridge. What's the big red drag- the big- blah, blah, blah. I need to speak English. The big red- Big black dragon with a red jewel on the forehead. Thank you. I know how to speak. <laughs> Sometimes. <laughs> and we'll have to go all the way here. There are like a couple dogs, nothing really dangerous about. I mean, they're just dogs, but the dogs are terrifying in Dark Souls, so. Oh. Okay. Stop. <laughs> he touched me like three times in a row. That's silly. And is there anything else here? Yeah, one more over there. Two more, actually. Eat a fist. And the other one. God damn it. Just block onto it. Thank you. So let's go back in here. Go, 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 go. And you can hear it, and he's flying. Look at that. So, 
if we go down there without the proper items or the, the uh, talking about talking with that NPC, this is what's going to happen. He's just going to be flying everywhere, um, searing the place with fire, and we won't be able to do anything about it. But there is an, uh, you can see it right there, a secret chest with an upgrade material. I'm just gonna grab it just to show it. Look at that. You see? And that's all that he's going to do, and he's going to insta kill us. <laughs> but we cannot, we cannot fight him as we are right now. But now that we saw it, oh shit! I'm, I'm, I don't, I don't want to be there. Let's warp again to the Old Seal Township, and now we can talk, talk to the Archer, and he will help us, help us defeat this thing. Okay. Let's run real. Let's run. Right past everything here. Back the stairs. Now, prepare to. Okay, this is my opinion, of course, but prepare to see one of the coolest cinematics on gaming. Because it is absolutely cool as shit. Let's talk to him one more time. And we can also go kill this dude, but I don't wanna. I mean, he's just peacefully living his life. Black dragon posing the duress? Yes. Yes. I thought as much. It's called Calamite. A versus dragon and beat even mighty ant from the dead not provoke his eye. I see little good coming from this, but... My intent is to persevere to the bitter end. Yes. <laughs> good, good. What is bravery without a dash of recklessness? I've taken a liking to thee, and I owe thee much for thy service to Artorius. Now, what? Epic as fuck, man. I didn't drop the controller, I just want to enjoy that cutscene, man. Oh man, look at that. That that's a that's a touch, right? Like he's blind. He has to feel around to, to get his bow. And his bow is like fucking massive. Look at this. I smell every single time that I see that. God damn. Yes. True or shot was never loose. Damn. Thank you, God. You are a god. Slain. Knighthood highest calling. Now, remember, he is blind. So he grounded. The biggest, meanest dragon while being blind. <laughs> God damn, that is so, so, so cool. I love that cinematic. And it's, it's, we don't have much cinematics in the deals in Dark Souls, right? There are more in the DLC, of course, but that one, that one takes the cake, dude. And the music is so, so epic. I love it. <laughs> I am going to start to stop fangirling around and tell you how awesome God is. And we are going to kill that dragon. Because that's our... That's the... That's the way we do the things here. When I go kill us a dragon. And after that, we just need to end the game. <laughs> Let's see how, how we fare against Calamite. It, sh it shouldn't be that hard. Oh, I said that, and I immediately regretted it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat my words. I feel it.
At least I don't remember it to be that hard. What the? Okay. Now we have a uh, fog gate there. Get in. We have to come down these stairs. And I hope I, I don't know if we can see it right now. No, he's still hidden. We need to actually go down and oh, that's a crystal lizard. Oh it disappeared. Let's get our Look at the music. This is right there. I don't care about the souls. I just want to, to fight this thing. Hi, Calamite. Oh. Okay. That was a gunshot. A shotgun thing. Let's heal up. Fire. Okay. Try to get the items. Uh, okay, that's not the best damage. He's gonna. Yeah, we need to run away. Heal up real quick. Because he can. I'm pretty sure he can two shot us. Okay. Careful with the. The stumps there. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay. He can, he can really defend the, his position, right? With the fire. And that's a grab attack that you don't want to get hit with. The thing with Calamity is that if you get hit by that, by the attack of the, the red duel, you will actually get... Your wall will take more damage. And it's a, this becomes a ring that you can wear to get the, to make the game more difficult. And also a... Okay, careful, careful. Thank you. And also a... Does that hit? No, didn't hit. Thank God. Oof, but that did. That thing becomes a ring and it's a recurring thing on Dark Souls. Um, one and... Three, if I'm not mistaken. I don't remember if Dark Souls 2 had the ring implemented. They have something similar, of course, but not the ring itself. And yeah, that that will make you that will make a difficult game even more difficult. Let me buff. Let me buff. Let me buff. Okay, thank you. Cool. Kelly, stop running away. Ow, oh, that trick a little asshole. We are out of heals. But we are like half health. Okay, close. Damn. Okay, I need more healing, but after. Getting that, we should be, we should be, should be good to go. A couple more Estus, and probably I will use power within against this dude. And we should be fine, we should be really... We shouldn't be having any problems. Now, let me warp to... The Ulusip Township Dungeon, that should be the one that I, that we got... Kindled for, for Manus. And if I get there, I have the... Yeah, I got 20. Cool. So now let's, once again, go to the township. And I'm actually thinking to... To lose this... This legs and... Get back into a lighter, lighter load. Because I think that dodging this... Their attacks with the... The flipper ring will be better. Let's see. Okay, so just again, two just two more bosses to go. We are just missing uh Calamite, Windling, because I, I just wanted to make be able to use Dark Moonblade for a lo as long as possible. 
And we finish the game up by fighting Lord Dwin. And that will be all for Dark Souls 1, Fist Weapon only, and we're going to jump into Dark Souls 2 next week with the same kind of character. We're going to be punching our way through Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3. Until, or hopefully before, the, Elder, the DLC for Elden Ring drops. And those dogs are so annoying. Stupid dogs. Trying to get that promotional thing for, for the stream and they are making me look bad. Again. <laughs> okay. So hey, if you're interested in that, in this type of content and all that, well, I will have it in I will have it on YouTube, I will be streaming it on Twitch. I am trying to grow both things at the same time because I um I have nothing better to do, I guess. No, not really. I just I just enjoy making content. Let's what else? Let's go with Gold Pine. Just because he's a dragon, it should be weak to lightning. Not sure how true that is, but we'll find out. Oh, we got the items there. We need to kill the Crystal Lizard, but that is really not a priority. And I'm just going to wait for Kalami to come to this area. It's not gonna take long, that's for sure. Can we get that item still while we wait for... Oh, that's fire breath. Nice. Diving. Okay. I wasn't expecting that for sure. Yeah, the head is the most difficult or the most dangerous part about this thing. And he can sweep like so much. Look at that. Like an almost an. Um, Oh crap, 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 okay. Yeah, the, the flipper ring is our ally here. Damn, stupid range. Oh, it got, it got stomped on. Heal up real quick. Evade the fire. And they bait the fire once again. <laughs> come on, Calamite, come here. Mano a mano, let's fight. We're gonna punch a dragon. Okay. Run, 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 run. Fire breath. Fire breath again. Okay, it's been easy. Easy so far. Damn, I thought I was going to be able to avoid that. Okay, that's a huge hit, man. I forgot that he combos that one. Damn it. But I'm gonna be honest, like, compared to, to Manus, this guy is a piece of cake. Go to... which one? Township. That should be the closest one, right? I believe. Well, let's actually rest in, the, in this one. That way we don't have to come every single... We don't want to have to warp every single time. I believe this is easier than Manus because he's not so chaotic. The problem is that he does a ton of damage. But we need to be... We need to be on point with our dodges and... There's also a thing that you can get from this thing, and you can actually hit the tail and cut it. And if you do, you get a special dragon weapon that is really, really badass. Can I just, like, avoid this thing? So I don't want to waste every single... Every single run here, I don't want to waste time, like... Okay. I mean, I can, but they are, they are going to be annoying. 
Let me, let me pass. Oh, thank God that we have, that we have iframes here. Right, let's go down. Let me fix my oh, posture real quick. Oh. Let's do this. But I think that if we had put a little bit more points into hell, we will be absolutely fine. But we didn't, so we have to deal with the consequences. Okay, think. what are you gonna do? Yeah, figures. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Dive. Okay, the hitbox is really stupid there. Let's heal up. I'm gonna punch a dragon inks the dick. <laughs> That's our way to victory, man. Damn. Oh, but if we're close here, we can punish the fire breath. But if, just if we stay close enough. Oh, fuck me. Okay, I need to run. Kill up. Awesome, let's go. Again. Punch a dragon in the dick. Hey, I am I'm taking it. I don't care. This is the way that we're going to win. Oof. Okay, that tail tag was has a lot of range to it. God damn. And the dive bomb. It's fine there. It's try to hit it. Need to be careful with the food that I roll to towards. Okay, that will give me chance to heal. Awesome. I'm going to try and see if the if the fine resting actually does something. Let's see. Hey Calamite, what are you gonna do now? Okay, cool. That's that's great. Except the part that I kicked you instead of actually hurting you. 107... I don't know if that's better or worse. <laughs> I mean, it's, it can be worse, but I don't know if that's... Like, convincing enough to keep using... Fine resin. Okay, so he can... Alternate within the two... Yeah. He can figure it out. Okay. That was not a good thing to do. No way! We survived that with a stroke of luck. Okay, again. Punch the dragon in the dick. See how it reacts to it. Wondering what are you going to do now? Okay, okay, that's perfect. That offers us a, a chance to heal. No, I got hit. Okay, I can show you this at, at least. This is the I don't know, remember the, the attack specifically, but now that we have that red eye, he's going to probably get us absolutely destroyed. Just like that. I'm gonna heal. Fuck this. Need to be real careful now. Okay, that works. Thank you, Gummy. Okay, so did you see that? This isn't really like a difficult fight. This is. He deals up a ton of damage. 
and we are not equipped to handle a lot of, a lot of damage. We're close, goods. We're so close. And I think, like I said, like we're gonna punch the dick off this dragon till he's down, baby. He's down. <laughs> Once again. Oof. That was that was close, man. We got the calamity ring and we defeated the black dragon calamite, ending the DLC with a. Big, big bang right there. And you were, yeah, you were here, man. Thank you for being here. And okay, so if we learned something about this this uh, playthrough, is that the best way to win is by cheating at boxing, punching demons, and slapping demons in the ass. And apparently, the weakness of any dragon is getting punched in the dick. But that's what that, that gave us the victory. We all have to agree with that. And now let's. Watch me get mauled by dogs. You know, I, I, I'm not gonna risk it, and you're gonna use my gold find, my homeward. I don't wanna risk getting killed by dogs. Let's level up. Let's again as much health as possible now. And also, let's see if we can pop some some souls to level up. So yeah, just one, two more, two more bosses, and we're done. So. Dudes, we are so close. We're so, so, so close. And the, the next boss that we're gonna kill is right away, and it should be super easy. I don't think it's gonna give us so much trouble. At least not as much as Manus, that's for fucking sure, man. And finally, we're gonna end the game. And we're gonna go run past everything there. And we're gonna get the... We're gonna link the, bon the, the bonfire. Oh, we sh that should give me, yeah, two more levels. Not gonna complain about that. Awesome, let's repair everything. Now let's warp into the Dark Moon tomb. Let's go. I was here again. Hey, we have been taking down bosses left and right, so... Um... <laughs> It's been entertaining. It's been well. Hopefully, it's been entertaining. I, I've been having a blast. I don't know. I don't know about you guys. Hopefully, you you have been you're feeling you're feeling the same thing. But now let's let's kick a a mage guy. I want to kick your ass. You know what? Fuck the cinematic. I want to kick your ass right now. I don't give a fuck. The only thing that, that this thing can do is just run away and throw magic at you. And that's why the pillars are here, just to... Like, run around... Run around their, the stupid archer build... And kick her in the nuts. This is a, the easiest fight in the entire game. Except for perhaps, I don't know, um, Capra Demon, maybe? Because he's designed to be like the easiest fight. Okay, I said that. Eh? She got. Okay, almost there. Just one, a couple more hits and she will be. She will be done. Well, I say she, but she. It's a, it's a he, actually. It's just like he. Feels and represents as a, as a female, so I feel that it's better if I call her she. Big bang attack. Okay. Be stupid magic circles that I don't give a fuck about. Done. Easy. <laughs> easy here. Easy. 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 Absolutely easy. Fuck you. I don't care about your courses. Um, Marks. Uh, Sons. You can write right then. Like I was here again, again. <laughs> And you're gonna do it one more time after we finish with the next boss. But here, we're gonna unlock our final power-up. Let's see... it's right... this is this one, right? Oh. Miyazaki, why? Why leave an empty chest here? What's the point? That's it. The Sunlight Blade. Now, 
we are going to end the build with... I'm gonna also actually do this because I don't... I don't want to run ar around there. Let's get here. Let's attune magic. Sunlight blade. Repair all things. We can level up right now. Still missing a lot. And now we're going to warp to... We should have the... Then we have it. Fire Link Shrine and Rolando. Probably we don't have it, but let's fuck it. Let's go to Fire Link Shrine. I'm still here. <laughs> God damn it, man. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go past everything here. We're not going to bother this dude. We're just gonna roll ourselves. And we're gonna kick the final boss's ass. Let's rest here real quick. Let's get some humanity. Let me parry my punt my Okay, cool. I also want to get this Hornet Ring. I know. I have never tried to kill this boss the way that we're going to be killing it right now. I always try to run around to to hit it, run away, hit it, run away. But there is a technique that we can use on this dude. And it's actually just parrying their his attacks. And consistently doing uh, critical da critical hits on him. I haven't done this before, so I might suck at it at first, but that's what I, w I want to get better at it. And hopefully, hopefully, hopefully we're gonna get this, like, quickly. Nope. So there are a bunch of Dark Knights here, they can... They can drop their weapons, they can drop upgrade materials. The armor set is actually here as well, it's like right there where my where my head is. But I don't care about any of that. And they're still going to be respawning every single time we kill them, so... It isn't even worth doing it. I'm just gonna get... Give them the run around. Get back here. Oh, they're gonna follow me. Yeah, okay, let's run. Let's just run. Run for it. Beat Axe, dude. Nope. And finally, the Halber guy. That, ooh, okay. Okay. Nope. <laughs> Not gonna happen. Leave me alone. Okay, let's do this. Now. Whoa! Okay. Cheating much? Yeah, baby! Go fuck yourself, old man. You're not gonna grab me, but don't even try. Okay, the, the problem is that the fire sword, you can't see shit. Oh no, boy. No, 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 no. You're doing it all wrong. <laughs> We're punching the final boss of the game in the dick while listening to exactly the best song in the game, Plim Plim Plon. What was that? What was that? Sorry, what was that? My... What? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> We were doing it perfectly, man. Except for the part that the, the Black Knight dudes actually kill kick our asses. Plim plim plon. Yeah, I mean it's it's of course not called plim plim plon, but that's the sound it makes. So we are we love it. We love to mock it. But mm, the best music in the game. Yeah, yeah, it has to be right. It has to be the best the best song in this thing. Okay, now let's. Once again, run past every single dude here. Now, this is the, the... Where Dark Souls shows its age, right? That way you have to run, like... For minutes on end to... To get back to the boss fight. And that's something that I'm really happy that Elden Ring fixed. And for Dark Souls 
3, for the most part, they fixed it having the bonfires, like, closest to to the boss fight. Like, for if this were Dark Souls 3, the, the bonfire would be, like, right here. Like, here. Halfway through it. Just to avoid having the, the issue of running every single time. Now, the thing is that now that I know that these guys can hit me uh, through the fog gate, I need to enter the fog... I need to... Okay, I'm going to buff up first. Yeah, oh well, I don't think I have... I will have the chance to do so, but let's try. I want to buff, I want to... And I need to change real quickly to the parry, and see if I am able to do, to do it. And I need to get away from the wait gates, if not I'm gonna get hit by these assholes. Okay, so... Did you see that bullshit, right? Okay, so, win, come on here. God damn it. Hey, Dessel, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I mean... I'll be honest, without the, your advice on the shower thing, and... taking advantage of the... Um, the tantrum, like... the opportunity to have that extra attack, it would have been way, 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 way more difficult. So, thank you for the for the advice, and thank you for, for coming back, man. I hope, you're, I hope you enjoyed the fight. I, I hope that you enjoyed my suffering enough to actually tell me, like, okay, we need to help this... <laughs> We need to help this suit. <laughs> and now we're just trying to do one more extra challenge, and is trying to parry win uh, until he's dead. Like that's the way that we're going to try to kill it. We're not going to do anything else. We're just trying to parry him and get advantage of that. Oof. Okay, it was close. But the funny thing is that it, we're trying to like run run past the Black Knights, and every time we enter the the arena, they have a sneaky little hit on us. And funny enough, as as we are, I have been coming to expect for now, they do like half my damage in just a single hit. Okay, so you come here, please. Okay. Bye bye. Alrighty. Oh, oof. Okay. Should I buff up outside? I think I will. You know what? I think I will. It's, I don't think it's gonna be much of a difference. It's gonna last a couple seconds less, but I guess that's fine. I need to get... So get in and move out of this... of the fog wall, please. Just roll. Okay. They should he shouldn't hit us. Damn it! Okay, again. Again, 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 again. Cool. Okay. Let's get this thing done. Let's heal. Cool. There's another one. Stupid sore, I can't see shit with the flames on that thing. Okay. We are three now. Three in a row. Three in a row. Come on. Four. 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 Yeah. <sighs> Bam! Right to the face. One more. One more. Okay. Okay, we recover from that one. Let's heal up. Let's heal up. Okay, need careful, careful, careful. Heal up. And... Okay, that's the thing with when he doesn't allow you to heal that much. Heal up. Thank you, Win. Okay, let's go. Let's continue the parry master's way. One more should be enough. One more, one more. Let's go. Fuck me! <laughs> this close! This close this time! Fuck me! Now, let me let me ask you something real quick. Is Wind weak to lightning or is he weak to fire? Because I also have I mean I remember something about him being weak to fire, but I don't remember correctly. 
F. Yeah. F in the chats, please. F in the chats. We were this close, but I, I don't, I'm not going to take that. This needs to be the epic showdown of Rocky Balboa against Win the Lord of Cinders. We have to make this parry only. Like, if, if I might add like one little like, extra challenge, I, it has to be that, right? I need to get good at parrying. I know that I when I miss the first one, I panic and try to get the second one. That's when I get absolutely destroyed. No, thank you. I need to, again, focus. Keep a calm head and get through this. So, Sent, I know that you haven't that you haven't played Dark Souls 1. I know that you have, of course, seen gameplay of it. Let me ask you, in like overall the uh, the challenge and the experience of Dark Souls, like what do you think about it? I know you're going to you're going to play it, but now that you have seen it being played by someone, hopefully that of course gets you to play it. I know that Kuro is actually Kuro told me that he was going to install the game. <laughs> And play it just because the badass with your Rocky Lobo alone. So let me let me let me ask you because I know that you have plans to play like Final Fantasy and other games, but would you be wouldn't you consider the the chance to play Dark Souls? Like now that you have like properly seen like someone you know like play this thing. Okay, like, once again. Okay. Yeah, no, I don't want to take that grab. Ah, go on. You want to start tomorrow? The souls. Okay, that's cool. That's cool, man. I'm finishing Zelda Breath of the Wild. Today. Oh, okay. Also, oh, you're you are finishing Zelda today. Cool. Cool, cool. I. I, we'll see, I already finished Dark Souls 3, I'll see if the experience is different. I mean, it's gonna be different. Um, well, my opinion, of course, it's gonna be different because Dark Souls 1 and Dark Souls 3 are... They are apart, like, for, what, 10 years or something? And the refinement, it, coming from Dark Souls 3 to Dark Souls 1, you are going to see, you are going to feel it. It's not going to be noticeable, it's not it's not something that makes the game bad or anything like that. But you can notice like a little bit of clunkiness. And moving from Dark Souls 1 to 2 and 3 now, we we will see that in the stream as well. And Kuro now talking about Breath of the Wild. Um you know that I haven't I haven't played that thing, right? I, I have it, I, I bought it a couple months or years after it came out. I am Okay, buffed up way early. No, it's okay. I don't think the buff is actually doing some doing much. But I, I don't know. I, I mean, Breath of the Wild. I know that everyone lost their collective panties about it. And for, for some reason, I when I tried to play it, I don't know. I I felt like it was so so much of an open world that I really didn't know where to go, what to do, what's what the hell was going on. Like, for example, uh, I'm, I'm sent, I already told you about this. Like, there is a thing in, like, a village. Like, there is, like, a sphere, right? And the sphere is, like, right next to it, and I cannot take it. And I'm like, why can I not take this? What's... Okay, that trust is new. Nope. Let's heal. Damn! I am getting worse! <laughs> I'm not getting better, I'm getting worse at it! Holy crap! Fuck me. But yeah, and, and, I, and I feel like that. I feel like that, like, okay. So, there is a ball here that I could just take and move it to the place that obviously belongs to. But it's like, no, you can do it. You can do that. Um, you need to... You need to wait. You need to get another power in the game. And you're like, oh, come on! Yeah, I need to fulfill- I know, I know that I need to- I need- I guess I need, like, a, the, the, the magnet power or whatever that is. But, uh, I don't know, I felt like- but it's right there! 
However, one thing that I, I really, really, really enjoyed about Breath of the Wild, I didn't play it for that much, but something that I liked was going to the, the field where the, the guardians are, the, the spider things, and try to parry every single laser. Sort of what, what I'm doing right now here. I like that a lot. I, I, I think it's funny that you can like repel the attack and all that. However, when I tried to do it, I had like the, the first shield that I found, like, 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 like a piece of wood. Not even, not even stitched together, it's like a piece of wood that it was lying around. And, like, yeah, it wasn't pretty, like... The first, the, when I missed the first, the, the first thing that I missed is like, no, you're dead. Yeah, go back to the beginning, you fucked up, go, go... Go, go, fuck yourself. And it was like, okay, for some reason, I like that. So, your earlier comment about me being a masochist... Might not be so so wrong, <laughs> actually. I might Dark Souls might be for masochists only. No, go fuck yourself. I mean, it may be like Elder Ring. If a pass is not for you right now, you can go to another. Uh yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see. Yeah. Okay, but I I need to get the timing of that thing. Okay, I can heal here. Gonna probably kick my ass now. No, he did. I did. I did. I did. I did. Cool, 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 cool. Let's be. Oh, that was a little fast. Cool. One hit. <sighs> okay, focus, 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 focus. Too early. Stupid thrust stack. God damn. Okay, I need to be careful, because I'm trying to measure his hand. But because of the, the giant flames, I'm not able to see it correctly. Whew. I need to try- I need to time it right. I need to really, really try to get it together. Like, if a path is not, you will... Okay, yeah, I, I see your point. I actually see your point there. But that's the thing, I don't think that I understand or, or played it enough to understand what am I su what what I is supposed to do with the game you know because I was like okay I have a big open world I have some a couple of like shrine things that they have trials for me and other than that I, I was like okay what now you know maybe because if my first cell like by the first modern cell that I play in you know, that the only one that I played was uh, the DS thing for Phantom Hourglass, that you tell me that it's the worst thing ever. So maybe that, because I haven't played a Zelda game, I really don't know what to expect out of it. So I really don't know, I didn't didn't know what where to go. I, I found that village, I think, by pure randomness, because I started just going around the map, trying to get all the shrines. They're called shrines, right? No, they're like all like sanctuaries, if I'm not mistaken. So I got to the village. I talked with uh with the the old lady there. I mean, okay, you 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 wake we wake up and blah 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 blah. And after that, I was like, okay, I got no idea where to go. Maybe I wasn't paying attention. So maybe maybe it's, maybe it's my problem. So maybe it's something that I played it. Not that I played it wrong, but maybe I wasn't paying enough attention to actually understand what's, what's going on. Yeah, that's the thing. I, I didn't know how to get to the main quest. I think that's, that was my thing. Mm, still too early. Oh, damn. Okay, heal, 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 heal. Early. Early. Ah, damn. Real <laughs> is totally different from the Ocarina of Time formula. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean that that sh that should be obvious, right? Because that was the first open uh, open world Zelda game. Little by little. You know what? That's that's a good advice. I always think that's a good advice because maybe what happened with me is that I felt overwhelmed 
about for the, the all the places that you can go to and at the same time i felt so confused about where to go next like to to make progress that i just quit it and i'm, I'm not i'm not going to say that the, the game was bad or anything like that i mean it was fucking game of the year um but i should actually go and and play it like take my time with it I something different because it happened to me with Minecraft. Um, that's a good comparison. Mm. That's actually a good comparison. <laughs> like Minecraft and Breath of the Wild. Because of the, ex the extensiveness of the world. Like, you are overwhelmed by with possibilities. You can either... Example Minecraft, right? You can... Like, you can build a hole in the ground and... Or you can go, like, collect materials and get a mansion get diamonds, get like the best gear, enchanting, like there's so much stuff. And the worst thing is that, and this could be me being me, but I don't think Minecraft actually explains any of the mechanics, right? Like you're just dropping the world and there is no tutorial or anything. You're just like, well, good luck. And that's it. So it's, it's impressive. It's, it's a testament on, damn it. I stopped jumping around. Okay. Ah, careful, careful, careful. Okay, dude. Okay. The second one I can normally predict. The first one is the one that is giving me trouble. Yeah. So... Hmm. Huh. Nope, that's the grab attack. I don't want that. Oh, okay. So, this, the two-handed one is right where the hilt is at my face. The thrust is annoying as hell. I hate that thrust one. It comes out of nowhere. But that's, that's crazy, right? That you know what to do in Minecraft just because you have seen so many people play it. That you are actually no. Okay, that's that's not nice. Win, please take a chill pill. Okay, I can heal there, and he's gonna punish that. Oh fucking course he will. Damn it! If you don't give me what to do, I get lost. Yeah, that's the thing. If you don't have like a like a goal to to pursue in a game, especially like a big open world one, you get absolutely. Like, you get lost. You get absolutely lost. Like, for example, like, going back to, to Souls things, like Elden Ring. Elden Ring, I perhaps didn't... Okay, the Elden Ring gives you, like, a little tutorial. The, you have, like, the tutorial cave. You get the first boss, and you get your ass kicked. But after that, you... I don't know if it's maybe the game design that... You are usually taken, if you are not, like... Exploring every single nook and cranny at the beginning. You get to the waterfront, the waterfront, the ruins, the, the, the first like big area. You enter the bridge, you go up, 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 and for some reason you always end up in... in Stormbird Castle. And maybe Margaret gets your ass, but at least uh, for some reason you always get there. At least for me that happens. And after you know the game, is then is when you try to okay. I know how to get. I want to get this this item first, so I can do this 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 and this. And then you get you have your like your own direction. With Minecraft, I don't think that happens, unless you again you know what you want to get out of Minecraft. Like you know that well. I want to build. I want to build a house, and you go find wood. That you 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 are your own like compass. If I get if I. If, I don't know if I'm explaining myself too well, but if you understand a game enough to to understand the mechanics and all that, then you can be in an open world game. You can be your own compass and try and and either secrets break the game or get powerful early. Or okay, let's get out of there quick. Okay, so how when do I have to get that parry, man? 
Okay. Careful there. I need this I need this dude to be I need to be in control of this situation because if not I'm gonna get slapped. I'm I'm, I'm getting slapped right now, and I, I think these dudes are going to hit me if I don't get if I don't move out of the Okay, third one. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. And that's the grab. Okay, fourth. Boom. No, 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 I'm getting stupid. No, I got stupid. No, 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 no. Okay, let's heal. Heal, 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 heal. Oh, damn. Damn it, wind. Why do you have to be so punishing? Oh, damn. Damn, that combo. Oh, damn. And this is the main thing about Battle of the Wild is look to the horizon, go where you want to go, and check what happens after that. Uh, even this main quest and side quest. This approach that I'm taking with Dragon's Dogma. Okay. I mean, it's completely reasonable, right? Like, and that's the thing about being your own compass, right? Like, you set a destination on the map, or you look at something interesting on the horizon, and you say, like, okay, I want to go there, no matter what, I'm gonna go there, let's see what's in there. And that's a... I don't know, I I think that will be... that's the, the most fun that you can have in a game. Like, being able to explore at your leisure, but the only thing that I will I will keep a caveat is like I know that I'm doing that because I am avoiding the main story, right? But if I wanted to go there and make some progress, I I would I will want to know where it is. You know, like okay, I started exploring, so I want to go back and and do some um do some quests. I can do that, you know. Uh maybe I am more trained because I I. I tend to play more like single player um like i don't know like like linear games maybe i am not so accustomed to like really really open world rpgs even in games like um what's, what's it called like uh divinity divinity original sin at least in there you are confined to a little zone and you're gonna do a bunch of shit but you are still in that little zone, and you move to the to the next zone after you complete, like the quest on the, on where you were. Maybe maybe I'm just slow with things. I don't know. But I will we will see how how Dragon Dragon's Dogma pans out. I'm really interested in seeing how how the open world thing goes. I'm going to try to avoid this one, actually, because I, I know that I can parry for shit. Right, now it's, uh, it's a grab. How much damage do I make with my fist? Okay, that's another grab. Okay, win. Oh, okay. Okay, dude, relax. Let me heal. Let me heal. Okay, that's that's something. That's better. Okay, can you? No. Okay, that attack is going to punish because it's annoying. Okay, once. Let's go. Divinity is massive. I know, I know, I know. It's a massive game, but you are confined to an area before you know exploring the the whole map. Like you at the at the beginning of the divinity, you are in the boat. After that, you are in like the the prison thing, and then you move like to the woods and all that. So I know that it's massive, but at least has some some progression. I don't know if that's the way to call it, but that's I think how I'm going to call it. Okay. Okay, we're getting we're getting there. We're getting there. Two more, two more. Maybe one if we're lucky. We win. Come on. Okay. Fuck you, man. Fuck you, old man. Oh, yeah. 
<laughs> Fuck yeah, dudes. Look at that. Dark Souls 1. Defeated with fist only. I'm gonna get Rocky out of his helmet. He looks like a stupid vampire now. <laughs> That's fine. W game, W streamer, GL, and Dark Souls 2. Thank you, Dazzle. Thank you so very much for being here. And hey, if you're going to be here on Dark Souls 2 and, give me, and giving me some amazing tips on that game, that by the way is the, my worst Dark Souls in all time, so I'll, I'll probably going to need the help. You're happy to, I'm happy to have you here, man. And the other guys here, Sen, Kuro, Nat, thank you so much for being here. And now we're going to link the fire. <laughs> Man, what an experience! <laughs> Took us what, like three weeks? Six streams? A bunch of tears? But now... We have definite proof that we can beat Dark Souls with fist only. We're gonna link the fire... To make sure that... The story continues in Dark Souls 2. Win Rocky Balboa 2! The Vengeance! And we're gonna kick some ass. <laughs> oh man. Love Dark Souls, man. Love I love Dark Souls so much. Looks like one Chi from Mortal Kombat. Hey! One one Chi was really pale. So respect. I'll definitely be watching and giving tips on DS2. Thank you, man. Thank you so very much. I'll I'll need them. Because I'll be honest with you, we all do right now, now that we're looking at the credits of Dark Souls 1. I have played Dark Souls 2 for like two times. I finished it twice in my it, since it came out, so it's my least played Dark Dark Souls game. And not even that is the worst part, is that I have never done the DLC of that game. So this is the, the, the place that I wanted to come with this challenge. Because Dark Souls 1, I know it, I know it kinda well. Um I think I did a semi good job. Finishing it. Dark Souls 3, I know it has way more way many mechanics that we can take advantage of to to finish it. But Dark Souls 2 is my least played game. Is of course has a lot of criticism. Not many people like Dark Souls 2. But I want to give it a fair try. I want to give it my fist. When I give it my all, I'm going to finish their game and the DLC for the first time ever on stream. So I'm hoping that you are I hope that you all are going to be uh, looking forward to that. Um, this has been an experience, this has been amazing, this is my first series in, on a stream, man. <laughs> um, you're going to have, I'm going to have this, I'm going to be working on this week to, to cut this into good pieces, taking the highlights and upload a video on YouTube, having the, the whole experience of Dark Souls 1, fist only. Um, if you want to see the, the highlights there, you can go to YouTube, I don't want to ruin the moment by self-plugging, but it's it's the job, right? I need to, to get my content out there if I want to grow. Um, thank you. Thank you so very much to everyone. I I am at a loss of words, so I'm going to skip the credits. <laughs> We're gonna be in New Game Plus now. Maybe we can do a New Game Plus series after we finish everything up here, but this will be the end of me for today. I am very tired, my brain is completely melted. And we have been here for six hours, so... But we did it, we did it, we, we, we fucking did it, man. <laughs> so, once again, um, before leaving, I want to make sure to tell you that... You are the most awesome people in the world. I want to thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for being so incredibly awesome. And I'll see every single one of you in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>